you hear me? Um, uh, loud and clear, whoever you are. Good, it worked. My name is Sony. Just call me Songbird, though. I know who you are. Know your situation, your problem. And I can see your life. All right, Songbird. Got my full attention. Glad to hear that. You must have questions, and I'll answer them in due course, shortly. But first, I need you to get to that swollen appendix of Night City called Dogtown. Fine. No clue when I'm stepping into, but no risk, no reward. Thank you. I appreciate this, truly. Dogtown's main gate. Be there as soon as you can. I'll make contact again then. What you got in the back? The usual. Implant boxes, Zeta Tech. Ah! my head in a place! B, ah! you're gonna be okay. Breathe deep. Count to ten. Recite a mantra. Whatever brings calm, helps you stabilize. Your nervous system took a big hit. Broke down. Racing heart, cold sweat. It'll pass. So... I know about the bomb ticking in your head. If I could disarm it now, I would in a heartbeat. You'll feel better any second now. Be something stinks here. Think she's with the relic. How in the... All true, Johnny. But don't you fret. Say. Enough. Us on the biochip protocol at once can trigger shocks for me, like you just saw now. Gotta cut you off. What? For your sake, for be safe. <laughs> Had to mute him for now. He hears you fine, just can't talk back. You a construct? Like Johnny? No, V. I'm a netrunner. Hopped on the Relic's cognitive protocol to dial in. I see and hear what you do. Just now, I am on board Space Force One, sitting right across from Rosalind Myers, President of the new United States of America. The President? <laughs> I... No. You're not joking. Dead serious, yes. The plane's been hacked. Trajectory set for Night City. They'll bring us down to Dogtown soon. Our comms are down, most likely jammed. The Relic was my only option. Right now, you're our one contact on the ground. How do I help and how much time we got? Too little to avoid landing in Dogtown. Likely enough to minimize losses, save some folks. That's where you come in, V. The President's life, her safety, that's your top priority. She'll survive the landing. Dogtown, not so sure. You'll need to get her out of the plane before anyone else does. Nothing's for free, Songbird. We should talk biz. Just got a taste of my abilities, I believe. There's more. I can cure you. Once and for all. I can't know how much I'd really love to believe you, but... I know, V. You've hit a dead end. Nowhere to turn. Been there. Believe me. Consider this, uh, an advance. The relic's crowded with clusters of corrupted data. I'm done with that. Making room for stuff that'll actually be handy. Such as? Some pre-militech combat stuff. 
It's just lying around, gathering dust. Huh. Thanks, I guess. I'm not being charitable. Need you at your damn best. Now listen. What I gave you is a skeleton soft. But the firmware's fancy. It'll learn. Grow with you. It'll improve if you feed it data. Combat analyses. Logs of legendary ops. Shit that make the NCPD piss its boots. Look around Dogtown. Gotta get there first. Main entrance is a no-go. You don't have an entry pass and I don't have time to produce a fake. You'll slip in the back way, quiet as you can. We really don't need anyone spotting you, scanning you. Guess so. After you. I'll be right beside you, as much as I can. Garage. There, past the fence. See it? Smugglers used to use it. Now it's your turn. Try to sneak in. You need to distract the guards. Um, something. When you go, look for a net access point. Jack in that, and I'll be able to help you. You should be one level lower. Eyes peeled. Look for a way down. Now, look for a maintenance room. Bet anything you'll find a power source inside. systems now. Hmm. Ancient. No, proto-ancient protocols. Largely corrupted data. Give me a sec. Need to ping one of our sats. Let's see which active Dogtown network links to this infrastructure. And putting in a back door. Ready to roll. Guide you to the garage from there. Hang on. Okay. Relic hack first. Then you slap the muzzle on Johnny. Then you bring some pile of scrap metal back to life. Serious trickery all. Who taught you? B, I'm an NUS intelligence analyst. Trained under the best peeps in the biz. And they took me on because around age 13, I got the local ripper to sell me a beat-up old deck. Rarely left in it since. I got noticed. The rest is history. Got a feeling stories incomplete. Likely longer. More twisted. Mm hmm? Might be. <sighs> Apologize up front for the quarry, but I gotta ask. Compeki Plaza Heist. Why? Compeki was pure ambition. Sometimes you hit a rudder and blaze your way out. Do something you'll be remembered for. Set my sights too high, I guess. Yeah, I know the feeling. But ambition, confidence, 
They're not bad in themselves. No. A human soul can be. What the? You alive? I think so. I need to hang tight for a sec. By the way, I must have gotten old right now. All in a faded rock of boy around. This thing is tiring. President Myers wishes you the best of luck. <laughs> nice. Tell Madam President I said, uh, hey. He got it. I laid out the details of our plan. Typical Rosalind. Keep me apprised, she says calmly. Just sitting there, sipping the gin, looking through her agenda, postponing beats. Woman's unshakable. Why does the city side night huh? Reminds me of when I was starting out. I'd look for places like this, set up a power bypass, jack in, essentially steal my way onto the net. Grab the riskiest gigs I could find, learning as I went, the hard way usually. Elevator, hop in. I'll do the rest. You'll be in Dogtown in a minute. Try to steer clear of Hansen's goons. Speaking of Kurt Hansen, what else do you know about him? Hansen was an officer. Militech. Tail end of the Unification War, his unit was tasked with taking Night City. They managed to secure a foothold in the southmost pocket and... stuck around. Refused to demobilize, laid down their weapons, found in Dogtown instead. Traded one conflict for another, basically. Hot or cold. No better way to make a buck than war. Up the stairs, through storage. You should pop into the market. Get your ammo, assault rifles, tactical gear. Hmm, to tame? Scare what we got in the back. This is Kurt Hansen. If you're hearing this, you've come to the right place. And see if you no, 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 wait, this ain't what it looks like. Taxes, who the fuck needs it? Dogtown, I keep your business. V, um, been meaning to ask. How bad is it for you? Clock's ticking, and fast. Relic will finish me, sooner rather than later. But you're here, looking for a means to survive. Still fighting. Think you'd do anything for another chance? Can't deny it. Shut up. We're in this together. There is that. Turns out I will be. So, good? We set? All right. Time you got up on the roof. The hell for? For the view. And I'm not being coy here. I mean, you'll see where we land, literally. Shit! Little circuit. I've lost access. What now? Try and restart the generator. Problem after problem. You keep breaking shit. It's tottering on its last feeble legs. <laughs> or you hack rough and the hardware don't like it. 
Finally, pop in. Elevator's roofbound. FYI, we're about to cross into Night City airspace. Might be a bit of a shock. Braced for it, and whatever comes next. Not sure one can ever be ready for a force landing. Dogtown of all places. But having you means my chances are looking up. You made it. Good. How's the sitch on board? Stable, but tension's rising. Unsurprisingly. See that? It's us. Space Force One. We're descending. And for a rough... Oh, fuck. What? What's going on? Songbird! And now, land it safe. Shit, Songbird! Thought you might have. Fuck! Yeah, I know, I know. Songbird the cat. Life number nine commenced. Alas. I made sure to get Myers to the safe room before I ejected. Run to the wreckage bay. Save her! Missile, Songbird? You just shot you clean out of the sky! No fucking way! I had no idea Hansel was that fucked in the head. We're that fucking determined. You need to hurry. Fuck you, good. Man, you got a plan? Find Meyer, get her to Liz Crest Street. It'll be the safest small oh. right now. Right. I'll be in touch. God speed me. Tank, for fuck's sake! Ugh. Shotgun on oh.
exploded. It won't explode. See anything? A whole lot of wrecked aircraft. Anyone alive? Nobody jumping out to greet me. Shit! Are we too late? Keep moving back. You'll see us safer. I'll pop the release on the door. One move! Who are you? You have five seconds! Relax. Songbird sent me. And you are? Name's V. Apologies. I had to be sure it was really you. Right. Let's still... <laughs> Fucking hell. They just won't let up! We need them gone! Every last one! Uh.
Songbird. You there? How's the cinch? We're alive. Both of us. Now listen. Head for the vacant building on... Elizabeth Chris. Got it. <coughs> Give me some credit. It's the best place to lay low. No heat signatures, so it's empty. Not a soul inside. Now get moving. Got Songbird on comms. She's fine. Found us a safe house nearby, too. Songbird. Had started to worry. I suppose I forgot she always lands on her feet. A crazy luck, both of you. <sighs> Maybe you brought it with you. This is some fucking nightmare. My people dead. All of them. Because of me. Whoa, whoa. Kurt Hansen killed them. Not you. <sighs> Is that what you think? You have no idea how deep this goes. We were hacked. That means Hansen had help. From Washington. The NUS government is aware of the crash, no doubt. They'll have sat mapped it. Seen us hit the ground in Dogtown. Unless... Unless the plot goes deeper. Hansen spreading his agitprop lies as we speak. I'm sure of it. Our people will have an even harder time crossing the border. I can't trust a soul. I just... Fuck! I don't know what to do. True. Got no idea how deep this shit goes myself. Do know, though, that falling apart won't help. Keep it together. Only way you'll survive. I'm afraid yanking my emotional bootstraps won't cut it. Let's give it a shot anyway. We stick to the plan. After that, guess we'll see. Wait a second. Damn it! If Hansen's got someone inside in Washington, that means I'm traceable. Wherever, whenever. I have a subdermal tracker. It needs to go ASAP. It's near an artery that's best not nicked. I'll need your help. I assume you know what you're doing. Be completely on your own without the tracker. Well... You're here. Okay so far? <sighs> Don't have a choice. <sighs> okay, okay. Breathe. Wait, is that? Drone. Finish up, quick. Cover now! Close. V? I'm here. Right on time. You in one piece? For now. Can't say I'll stay that way. We need to get to the top of the building. Talk later. Got Songbird on comms. Says we gotta climb higher. Lead the way. It's your city, after all. Kurt's hounds have caught your scent. You need to move. Delta time, let's go. We'll ask our guardian angel if she can get this elevator moving. Elevator could use a runner's touch, so... Already on it. Uh-huh. Sorry, V. My magic's no good here. What we need's power. There's a maintenance shaft with a fuse box nearby. Follow the scaffolding. Says I need to turn the lights back on. Might take a minute. Fine, I'll keep my head down.
It's running. Do you think it'll work? Lousy place to get stuck. There's one way to find out. What's the probability a random passerby noticed a moving elevator in an abandoned hotel? <laughs> right. Leave the analytics to Songbird. Little fuckers are fidgety. Sharp sensors on those. If they've sensed us already, the place will be swarming in no time. Great reason to move on and keep moving. My thoughts exactly. And mine. Just stay calm and keep quiet. Position. Something best avoided. Restaurant. Subnet access point in there. If you jack in, I can inject some fake hostile ratings. Send the drones chasing after geese. Throw up the risk, huh? Why? It's stupid. Where? It's not just your life on the line, B. Elizabeth Crest Street. That's where you need to go. You'll take old metro tunnels. Find the nearest station beneath an abandoned expo hall. Copy that. Ruth Myers, can you? We should all be on the same page. Songbird's leading us to a metro tunnel. We can pass through an expo hall. I think I know the one. Dogtown. What a joke. Did you all nuke this place? You all? First time I'm here. Likewise. And if I never make it back, it'll be too soon. Huh. 
Huh. Looks like a kind of museum. A museum of wishful thinking. Where the rich bought and sold so many unfulfilled dreams. No need to delay. way around this? Songbird, got a sitch. Can you jimmy the door? On it. Ugh, the lock jammed. Gotta brute force it, V. Time to roll up your sleeves. No need. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. Head for the elevator, just across the room. Huh. One of Hansen's warehouses, it seems. Gotta find an elevator. Other side of the room. Okay, here goes. V, do you hear that? Shit! Bastard's caught up to us again. Songbird. Hey. Bad news this time. Hansen's dogs caught your scent. Assault incoming. You probably got spotted outside. Either way, get ready. What now? Got a surprise for our guests. Making the final adjustments now. They won't get me! Keep up the focus, Hank! I'm busy for a sec. Need that. Myers, we gotta engage him. Song's on the case. Starting to heat up in here, Songbird. Working on it. Hold on tight. Where the hell they get iron like that? I'm oh, oh. trying. Songbird? What's with you? What the hell is going on, V? Dunno! 
Song's having a fit or something. Son of a bitch went haywire! For fuck's sake, Zumi! Slap a muzzle on the thing! This way! Quick! Through here! Come on, V! You're not dying on me today. Nope. Guess not. Right. Good. You okay? Injured at all? Nothing serious. I got lucky. Uh, can't stay here. Are you mobile?
die already. Yeah.
shit, bot. Nicely done. Good fucking rings. Safeguarding the nation. My ass. Yeah. Close call, that. <laughs> Good teamwork. And luck. A pile of luck, me. Grab what you can, and let's head out. There has to be an exit here, somewhere. this. Good stuff. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Come on! Fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? Let's pause. Think for a sec. What's eating you? I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Okay, gonna give it a shot. Be the songbird. Starting to worry us, girl. Song, are you there? No answer, huh? Guess you got me and only me. Great. See you again, Johnny. Curb the enthusiasm, kid. Never know. Could need me. So? Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. What happened back there? With so me? Tough to say. All happened in a blink. No one thing for sure. She was terrified. Like she had her worst fears boxed up and... That box popped open. Couldn't have said it better. I'm not sure I understand. You and me both. Somi's had occasional off moments lately. Temporary slumps. But I'm sure she's headed where we're headed. Same destination she gave us. It's the reasonable thing to do. Right. Reasonable. Girl's gonna have a hell of a hangover. If she wakes up. Southwest now. Feels like we're circling back. Yeah, saw mention an abandoned building. Place to lie low. No heat sig. Could use a little help. Of course. Oh, no. A damn fork? Well, we didn't account for this. Which way now? Thoughts? Hmm. Let's try this way. Here's where we surface. Christ, finally. What's the matter? Are you hurt? 
It's nothing, really. V, please. I have a highly honed nose for bullshit. Got a experimental Arasaka biochip in my brain. It's killing me, literally. Somi says she might have a solution. Wait. You're talking about the relic. That'd be the one. A secretive tech someone stole from Arasaka. On the day Saburo lost his battle with mortality, no less. Bingo. So that's how she could reach you. It also goes a long way toward explaining the nature of your deal. I appreciate the candor. Seems it's all for one and one for all, if we're to survive. Expecting more trouble? Tonight? I expect nothing but. It's best to be prepared for any contingency. Okay, this is us, safe. Great place for an ambush. Hopefully no one else thinks so. Guess we got here first. Seems so. We'll have to sit tight. Though I assume we'd rather not sit in the dark. Power would be useful. We could also get the radio up and running. What? Can't miss our daily dose of fear mongering? We need to know the situation on the ground. I want to change out of this mess. High time. Change. Into those filthy old rags. These filthy old rags won't be smeared all over every TV and terminal screen in the city. Unlike my presidential best. Have a look around. I'll join you in a minute. Check this, B. Attempted postmodern art. More like a home-cooked generator. Maybe we kickstart it. Literally. Uh-huh. Old Thornton engine pretty run down. A little bit of chew left, too. If the fuel's not degraded, it could actually run. But can't start it. Not without a power source. Sure, but seeing as we got a lull in the lead port down on us. Listen, got a bad vibe about this. You? Yeah, makes two of us. Gig's got too many twists and turns. Songbird, S-tier netrunner, promises a panaceum, a cure-all, then gets wiped off the map. Myers, shady politico, got a dagger thrown at her back all the way from Washington. Who by, and why? Fuck if we know. Oh. Plus Kurt Hansen and this fucking Sam launcher. Just preem. Got this hot itchy feeling in my groin. Like someone's not fessed up to something. One thing's sure. Plot runs Mariana Trench deep. We'll cobble together the full picture, piece by piece if needed. More like rest in pieces. Us both. Anyway. Let's get this power sitch sorted.
Should do the trick by my eye. In you go. Fire it up. Fingers crossed. And the maze balls. Look what I found. What do you say? There's more in the fridge. Feel free. You earned it. We're stuck in Dogtown with no sign of life from So Me. Not ready to celebrate yet. Suit yourself. But I won't let a good thing go to waste. Housewarming gift from Songbird, maybe? <sighs> Wouldn't it be wonderful? continues tonight around the downed passenger craft. And U.S. representatives claim President Rosalind Myers was aboard when catastrophe struck. City officials have yet to release any statement. However, one all-too-familiar figure did decide to speak out. Kurt Hansen, the self-proclaimed leader of Dogtown, called a press conference earlier today to offer his take on the situation. I'm being framed. Isn't it obvious? The NUSA's been out for my blood for years. Now I'm not without flaws. But another thing I'm not is suicidal. An attempt on the life of the head of the NUSA? What transpired in Dogtown is no trivial matter. I urge you all to consider the true motives behind this... spectacle. The NUSA will take any excuse it can get to send forces into Dogtown. And will they stop there? <laughs> no. You, good people of Night City, are next in the fucking line. Shit. Mark my Fuck words. This. Troglodyte's clever. Maybe too clever for his own good. So Hansen decided to wave a classic false flag. So doubt, reap apprehension awards, any NUSA attempt to get you back. Both ends fight in the middle. Well, you sure know how to cheer people up. Some mysterious party's out to trigger war. An attempt on my life's a damn good case of spell eye. God let Washington know you're alive, ASAP. Ah. Call Washington, without knowing who'll answer, friend or foe. Or should I go outside? Give Hanson snipers a big thumbs up. No, V. Neither's an option. Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird? Maybe. Can't be sure, though. It's our lucky day, Chumba. A penthouse with a view of the city. And lights that work. Well, this doesn't feel right. That never does with you, does it? Fucking killjoy. You want an angle on Hanson's airdrops? You got it. V, we need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. I'll be damned. Fuck this. No oh. time to lose. I will not be oh. surrounded. They didn't leave me a choice, whoever they were. That's two fewer problems down the line. Tough but necessary. Yes. Yes, you're right. The bodies. We really should do something. I saw a shoot in the hallway. Another problem solved. Don't know about you, but I've about had it with today. Tomorrow will come quickly. I need to rest. Here? What if more like them show up? That shoot's not going anywhere. You serious? Come on. The 
think I've had my fill of surprises for one day. Still nothing from so me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. So, what a songbird don't show. We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well... Then... I'll have one other option to consider. But let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. <laughs> Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. Hmm. See you in the morning, V. She's not here. Means she's not coming. Seen the swarms Henson has out hunting? Might have nabbed her. Possibility. One that concerns me the most. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Cadet still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Gotta talk backup plan. Not a plan, a man. The kind we need. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intelligence efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With the conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. Seven years undercover. Guy sounds like a true asset. Used to be with Arasaka once upon a time. Counter intel. Never saw any read on file. Above your pay grade, maybe? Consider that. Maybe I was too busy getting my hands wet and dirty. So, that's a yes. Go back, up your clearance, and check again. How do I find your guy? Guessing I can't just buzz him on his work hollow. Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. What now? Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. Sounds way overcomplicated. Gotta be an easier way. We'll call the FIA secret agent hotline and dial his extension. No, this is the only way. Uh-huh. So what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the? The file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Tell me I'm a special agent now. That's right. But taking the oath make it feel more real. Yeah, nah. Let's skip the formal thing. Is there a problem? It's just a big commitment, you know? Can't swear to something I don't believe in. It's your choice. I understand this was sudden. Good luck out there, V. And don't let the bastards nab you. Made the right call not taking that fascist ass oath. Oh, yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. How'd you come to that? Cause with the biz done, their arm will still be far up your ass and you'll be a meat puppet. No, I was once a corpo jarhead, right? 
practically dove into uniform head first. They had a real hard on for the oath. Repeat after me, bloody fucking blah. But can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. You sure you want to talk about this? Gotta hand it to you, V. Wiser than I. Maybe the Veep crashed Space Force too. V, in Dogtown, are you? Well, I've but one word of advice. Caution. Hand. <laughs> Sheesh. What's your link to this area? This is Pacifica's bumping, thumping business heart. Where the real deals are done. So, we finally gonna meet in person? I can say neither yes nor no. In lieu of an answer, I've no work for you. I hope you'll accept. One last thing. How you breach Dogtown's border, I'm not certain. Though, I suspect not via the main gate. Irrelevant in any case. I've secured clearance for your future convenience. Your name and likeness now registered in the system, granting unfettered passage over the district threshold. Talk again soon. It's a pleasure to share the road with you today, sir. Hey, how have you been? Very well, thank you. I feel today will prove an exceptional day. Oh, yeah? Any reason why? I've made a break... Ain't nothing without your help. Check out Ronald's Cream Stand. Ain't nothing without your help. Check out Ronald's Cream Stand. Captain Caliente. Guy clearly went down with this place. Stash house by the looks of it. Right. Let's see what's here. Huh. What's this? Antique. Junky variety. Wonder if it even works. I'll have a double cheeseburg while you're at it. Uh, anyone there? Hello? Fossil's probably busted. Or you flubbed the number. What the fuck do we do now?
Call me V. Andrew Jackson, basketball court. Daytime. Noted. Not exactly loquacious, our man of mystery. Could just prefer text. Damn sure I do. Take Jaden for the next gig. Why him? You a weak ass pussy. Yeah, he's kind of hot. But no, the thing is, he has some little Best seats in the house. Gonna be a game to remember. Johnny Silverhand. Basketball fan? That's new. You, you know what I mean. Another game started. Okay? One where your head's the fucking ball. He always said we could use another window. How do you mean? You're up against seasoned players, whereas <laughs> you just stumbled onto the court. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, her type is all. Politicians? Worse, armed forces. Saying no to high-ranking cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. No offense, but... Can we just chill a sec? Watch the game some. Enjoy just that. Why not? How about a hot dog and a cold beer while we're at it? Pretend we don't got a worry in the world. Yeah. That would be so ah. nice. Well, when you put it like that, fine. Savor it while it lasts. Don't turn around. Eyes on the court. Ah. Hands, Joe. Got this token. Mean anything to you? I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close, this one. Who sent you? Mutual friend. We don't have mutual friends. Friend survived an accident. You might have heard. I might have. Zone defense. <laughs> Keep pushing. Is she safe? Hard to say. The longer we sit here. That's it. Dribble around him. Were you followed? Did you even bother to check? Doubt I was tailed. So you didn't check. So you still got a ways to go. We'll work with what we got. Black Thornton Merrimack, on the street. Three minutes, front seat. We better leave separately. Don't want anyone to get suspicious. You first. Don't want to be caught holding hands? Reed. Slippery motherfucker. I think we really hit it off. Sure. Bet he's got candy in that van. Ready to find out? With the right scams installed, man, I pursue. Don't Blackthorn.
before we go, apologies for the precautions. I only ever rest so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Chun's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. Odd introduction, but nice meeting you too, Reed. Not a phrase I often hear in this trade. You're not in the biz, V. Our biz. Actually, I am. Though, just since yesterday. I was about to say your first time's out are the hardest, but... I'm not gonna lie. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. Arisaka Counterintelligence, terminated for undisclosed reasons. Now, a freelance merc, working for the FIA as of last night. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? Guess I'm still trying to wrap my head around it. Yeah, I feel you. I get tasked with correcting someone else's mistakes. I do my own rapping. Right. It's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. Address, please. Abandoned building on Crest Street, 8th floor. You left her alone? In Dogtown? Was I supposed to drag her along while cruising around? Mm. Actually? Look, place seemed plenty safe to me. Safe? A derelict building in Dogtown. Just listen to how that sounds. Hold up. I need to take this. Why are you calling me on my day off? Last I heard, you're the manager. Ask Bob, he owes me a favor anyway. Yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without me. Boss, man. I work the door at a club. Selection, you know, bouncing. Can think of one thing we have in common. Both got potential we're wasting. Being on Arasaka's payroll is realizing one's potential? Got a grudge. Saka so step on your toes that hard. Yeah, they try to off me. Botched it. End of story. You tell me. Makes two things in common. Well, something tells me we won't stop at that. Huh. This is not how I imagine spending my day off. Saving the president? Great action BD shit right there, am I right? Yeah, sure, I guess so. Does my eyes still smoke? Had a ciggy on a balcony this morning. Why you ask? When things start to spiral out of control, she's likely to light up. It's high time we help her out. Honestly, this is not inspiring confidence. She's capable of taking care of herself, you know. I actually had uninvited guests last night. Ejected via the garbage chute. Sometimes that's the only way out. tried to extract her forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would have gone quietly. Open up, it's me.
this how you greet me? Uh... Sorry. Roslyn, are you all right? I'm good. Glad to see you are too. Remember my number. Some numbers you never forget. Level with me, Rosalind. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. No, Reed. We need to talk first. All three of us. Here. The President, a merc, and a special agent walk into the Oval Office. Question is, where do I fit into this joke? You've seen the news. Uh-huh. Hansen's spin work never fails to amuse. He's not acting purely on his own initiative. Someone from our camp's propping him up. So, the cast of Hawks squawking for war. For some, the war never ended. This shit runs deeper, Reed. I wasn't alone on that flight. Songbird was on board, too. So me. I had a bad feeling about this. But now, now I see why. Where is she now? He was the last person to talk to her. Most likely scenario. Got caught in some ice in the combat, Bob, when she acted. One little mishack. Happens even to the best. But no way to know for sure. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, we need hard evidence, not speculation. Reed, I needn't remind you what this means for the NUS's national security. Besides, she's your prodigy, Saul. You taught her all your tricks. Hell, even recruited her. She and V have a unique... bond. It's a lead. Our only one for now. You two have to find her. Together. I already died for the cause once. Not enough? Smelling some real bad blood between you two. Time to settle this beef? Reed doesn't trust me. I can't say I blame him. I abandoned him in NC seven years ago. He's been stuck here. Paid a high price. Uh -huh. The NUSA crushed his career, while Arasaka tried to have him garroted. Look, every moment we spend pouting here, our chances of finding Somi alive drop. Hard. Barely know you, but you don't seem like a chum who'd leave their agent out to dry. She won't survive without backup. Don't know me well, but well enough, I guess. I wouldn't. I'm here. I'll help. But I'm doing it for Somi. And my country. Call me naive if you like. And you, V, whatever bond you two have fails to explain why you're here in the first place. I don't know how much they're paying, but you better ask yourself, is it worth it? Songbird's my only shot at surviving. Got Arasaka's relic in my head, slowly, surely, poaching my brain. Seems we're all on the same page now, V. Which means we can help each other, too. Agreed. Think so, too. If we want to find Somi, we gotta dig deep. I mean, actual reconnaissance. No stone unturned. We need contacts, informers not afraid to sing, who might see something in it for themselves. You'll need to earn their trust. Big ask in Dogtown. Won't be easy. I need to arrange a safe passage to Washington for Myers. Expect my call soon, V. Thanks.
Status. No real change, I suppose. Then it's time we got down to work. Gotta find our missing friend. Had another pair of eyes. Alex, former team member. She's in Dogtown, under deep cover. She'll help out. Uh. Adding another cook to the kitchen. Pretty crowded already. I trust Alex. Longshore oh. Stacks, a dive bar called the Moth. After sundown, yeah? Got it. And senses trained on any potential shadows. human awful. See how he likes being alone. Yeah, maybe you're right. Anyway, better get going. Take care. Chin up, sweet kids. Seeing sunshine round the bend. Just don't you let those bastards walk over you. What'll it be, honey buns? Surprise me. Adventurous. How special coming up. Sure am. Waiting for you. I'll be there momentarily. There's, uh, one thing you should know. Okay, what did that be? You know that op seven years back that went south? My eyes left me for dead. Cover story was I sold out to Arasaka. I never told Alex it was a cover. So, things could get tense. Got it. My tell is to go fuck ourselves. Something like that. I'm nearing the entrance. And there you are. Enjoy, honey bunch. Thanks. First time in here. I got that right? You new to Dogtown? Oh, hell no. I'm looking for an Alex. Like you are. You're on the awfully short list of folks we just don't serve here. Turn the around and get out. I have a gin and tonic. Make it a double. He's with me. You've got some balls. All right, my people. We gotta close up for the day. I ain't going fucking anywhere. Come on. You serious? Everyone out! Now! Seven! Seven f***ing in this hole! Cause of you, Solomon Reed! Holy... Sol ain't getting it. Maybe you will. Hey, what the hell? Relax. I want to talk this through. President Maya sent us. Got a mission in Dogtown. With him? 
FYI, seven years ago, this scumbag stabbed everybody no, in the back. Seven years ago, I was ordered to go to ground, and you were fed a cover story. I had to take the fall. There was no other way. Expect me to believe you? Just like that? Get the f out of my sight, both of you. This look familiar? Got direct orders from the president. Right now, that's all you need to care about. I cared. Cared for seven years. <sighs> but now? It's all right. Take a moment. Need a smoke. Let me try this. Give me a minute. You're gonna talk to her. Someone's gotta. And better me than you. <sighs> Couldn't wait till I was done. Could spit and Reed's drink if it'll make you feel any better. <laughs> He'd know. Old dog, but senses sharp as ever. Even spit wouldn't make it past him. So NUSA's tossing us back into the fray, huh? New mission? Yeah, afraid so. Well, fire away. Serenade me. FIA agent went missing. Reed and I are tasked with finding her. And all of a sudden, FIA remembers I exist. You know Dogtown better than any other operative in their ranks. Their ranks? So you're not FIA. Curious. <sighs> what leverage they had on you. Deal's just for this one op, then I'm out. <laughs> Wouldn't count on brevity. Me? One in the same mission for the last seven Been working the local arms and tech dealers since the war. My one op, that. Going real swell. Well, I got less time than that. Always starts the same way. Do them a favor, they promise one in return. Sometimes even deliver. Then one day, they nail your dick to the wall. This ought mean that much to you? Cause you're clearly hoping to get something out of it. Question is what? FIA and me, we're after the same runner. Interest aligned, so you're looking at Agent V now. Right. And the chair jock is? Songbird. Gonna take more than one sig to process that. Something the matter? Ah, so you don't know. Know what? Story of a clusterfuck op. One that led to Reed disappearing and me being holed up here for seven years. Here's the list of operatives. Reed, Songbird, and me. Haven't heard this, have you? Attention all residents, this is Kurt Hansen. Enemy collaborators... <laughs> That's just perfect. That means Tell me you believe in coincidences? Or... Fate? Cause plug the same variables into an equation, and surprise, gonna get the same. <sighs> well, you and that hangdog Judas are in luck. Cause I got a nasty habit of repeating the same gonk mistakes. <laughs> got conditions, though. So, what's your ask? Monaco. Wanna burn rubber along the Riviera? Drink champagne on a yacht with a duchess. Want a spy's retirement? Diplomatic posting in a warm, gobsmackingly gorgeous place where fruit off the trees is sweet and demand for fieldwork is zero. Think you can manage that? 
Reed will take you to Monte Carlo himself if that's what you want. Prem. Go back inside, tell him I'm in. Gonna need more nicotine before I look at his face again. Thanks, Alex. So? She's in. Just wants to spy his nice retirement in return. Don't we all? Can't say I blame her. So, heard you need someone to hold your hand, Reed. Take you on a tour of NC's asswart. I came to you because I trust you, Alex. If you say so. Fine. Songbird. Heard we gotta sniff her out. Song's M.I.A. Probably here in Dogtown. We were linked. Comms like. Song ventured into cyberspace, then got attacked. She vanished just after. That's all we know. We need a net runner. Kinda spends all their waking hours parsing teraflops of data. Might have caught something. You have someone in mind? Wilkie Slider Laguerre. I should have figured. Went rogue a while back, but I know where that little rat nests. So, we paying him a visit? Slider hides out in a would-be spa in Luxor Heights. Flick you exact chords in two secs. Or we'll rendezvous there. Alex and I have some, uh, catching up to do. <laughs> right. Just, uh, don't gouge each other's eyes out. Need both of you alive and healthy. See that tree there? Yeah, something special about it. Fitting, isn't it? How the prettiest thing here in Dogshit Town is a monument to the dead? Still don't get this gonk affinity for symbols and empty gestures. Don't really have time for your musings now, Johnny. Gotta wonder why I even bother sometimes. Attention all Dogtown residents. This is Kirk Hanson. We've got some important guests in Dogtown. Here by my personal invitation. Stay
You haven't been waiting long, I hope. Well, guess you and Alex needed a while to catch up. Hmm, yeah. All swell now, though. Let's go. Time's at a premium. They posted lookouts. Go figure. I doubt they'll play nice and just let us in. No harm in talking to them. Might let us through. They posted lookouts. I thought we'd talk it through. <laughs> choice when they opened up at us. <laughs> Fuck me. Solomon Reed. I would be lying if I said I have missed you. And you? You brought death to Mama Bridget. <laughs> Will that be your gift for me as well? Here to make a deal, nothing more. A deal? Let me guess. An empty promise and a bullet to the brain when you decide I am of no use to you. That kind of deal. I knew poor souls who tried to strike a deal with Solomon Reed. Remember them, Agent Reed? If one party is backed into a corner, it is not negotiation, it is extortion. You say tomato, I say fucking deal with its lighter. Now, cut the shit and do us the courtesy of hearing us out. Need some intel. Street says you're the one to get it. Me? 
I am a blind man. I see nothing, know nothing. Cyberspace is my only field of vision. Well, just so happens what we need is one who knows cyberspace. Sees lots in it. Donc, Dimsa, what specifically do you want from me? Soon after SF-1 crashed, a runner was attacked while on the net. Attack severed our link. We need to locate her stat. Ah, so you want one to investigate net traffic on the day of the crash? Got a malfunctioning relic in my skull. So how she made contact. That help any? Hmm. Perhaps. I will need a peek at this trinket in your head. No, nah, no chance, Slider. It is this or nothing. You choose. Keep your eyes on him, Reed. I am blind, not deaf. Let us see what we have here. I see traces, bursts of data in cyberspace, the wake of someone's passage. <laughs> Who dare they mad? This I do not believe. You out of your mind coming to me with this shit. What you see? The black wall. It bring only death. Specific, Slider. The woman. Did you know she used the black wall protocol to connect with you? Fuck. Explains a lot, actually. The woman? She is walking, ticking bomb. Megatons. She go boom, everybody fucked in the ass. Every last one. Miwanwa. It is a dam that protects us, the civilized world, from the strange bets of the cyber wilderness. If your two leg bomb crack the dam down the middle, it will unleash a flood. Wipe us off the map, just like Haiti. I think you're overreacting, June. You. you do not understand. You can be the chief of the NCPD, a corporal CEO, or even the fucking president herself. To the AIs, past the black wall, you are no more than a cockroach, a rabbit, a fragment of outdated code with no meaning. This why Netwatch flatline any who put integrity of black wall at risk. It's no laughing matter, my friend. It is a concern for the safety of all. That's why you, my friend, need to restore V's connection to our girl. You are out of your mind. Well, now you're part of this madness, too. Welcome to the shit show. Mordi. Non-negotiable, Slider. We need to find her. Besides, as long as she's out there, they catch her scent. They catch yours now, too. They'll sit their wirehead freaks on to you and your people. So, you'll help me clean this up, cover all tracks, snip any threads leading back to you and consequently us. Do that, and we'll be square. You'll be off the FIA's hook, too. <sighs> Meld, it's my lucky day. Here we go. Oh. 
together now. With Alex, too. I can hardly believe he's here, but it's a good thing. Songbird, I thought we lost you. What happened? That thing, it almost fried my brain. I had to look for help. Beyond the black wall. Heard it ain't exactly safe. Not exactly. That's clear. Listen, Vader. Don't have much time. Hansen's people tracked me down after I rezzed the Chimera. I've been... detained. I'm not in any danger. Not as long as I behave. Do what I'm told. I am the most help. Yes. Something's not right, man. Ah! Fucking black water. Ah. Black sapphire man. Captain's hosting a huge ship in there. Crash it on the sly. I'll find you. Make sure to tell me. I have a shot. You all right, V? Think. Slider might be dead. Connection severed. It's over. You shot sucked. Looks like you couldn't handle the load. Looks that way. You don't fucking say. Your G-man's a cold-blooded pragmatist. Was never gonna let Slider live. So, Songbird, what's up with her? Got the link back up, we spoke. She's fine, mostly. Needs our help, but she's fine, in one piece. Alright, give me the deets later. Come on, let's delta out of here. Could be more of Slider's lackeys looking around. Take it easy, Slider. Salopuya palueno. Weka sa. Saka sila. Yo tu tu tu. Unit down! What did Songbird tell you? Seem glad that you and I have teamed up. Good. It means she trusts you. Anything else? Song needs our help, Reed. Hansen's nabbed her, holding her. For reasons. God damn it. I can't imagine any worse news than that. Black Sapphire. Said Hansen's throwing a big bash there. We get in, she'll find us. Any idea what and where the Sapphire is? Over there. See the taller of the two scrapers? Next to the one with the big-ass screen. That's the Black Sapphire. A would-be hotel ended up a failed multi-billion eddy investment. Hence his fortress, smack in the middle of Dogtown. We can't just barge in. Doubt we have anyone on the inside or affiliated who could crack open a door, either. Alex and I will pull some strings when our contacts. We do the same. You know, think of who you know around here. Maybe we'll happen on an idea, find a way. No local fixer. Goes by Mr. Hands. Could ring him. Do it. We'll be in touch. Hands, need a favor. Straight. 
to Viz. I like it. Aiming to go to an upcoming shindig at the Black Sapphire. Lusting to dance with the devil. V, the place is inaccessible and treacherous in equal parts. You cannot simply walk in uninvited as opposed to the same. Compacting Plaza. Surely there's some way in. Very well, I'll be frank. A handwritten invitation, unachievable, but I can work something out. I'll need a favor in return. <laughs> Reputation is a currency. Its value derives from collective faith. It fluctuates. Do you understand me? Yeah, I see what you're driving at. Want me to help you earn a little rep? Precisely. Complete a few gigs for me, give my reputation at Dogtown a shot in the butt cheek. The Black Sapphire plans will be yours. All right, Hans. Got yourself a deal. I'm oh so glad. I'll be your Zane. Dressing. Still dry. Stitches all in place. <laughs> Odell Blanco? Name's V. Fixer said you need a hand. <laughs> More like a miracle. If the scabs don't scatter soon, our patients will start dropping in the street. What do the scabs want from the head doc? Well, there's this girl with them, Nika Yankovic. Said she's looking for her brother. What, he a patient of yours? Look, that's all I know. She wanted to talk to Anthony and seemed really upset. Scav's got all the doors covered. Main one, sure. Heard them setting up inside. But you know, they broke in through a window. Could still be a way there. Once you're in, head to Anthony's office. Find the altar, hang a right. Stairs will take you to the basement. If the Scav's heard Anthony, well... And all these people are out of luck. Leave it to me. Come on! 
chill. Gun down, let's talk. Here for Anderson. Need him out of here, alive. And I'm here for my brother. Couldn't give a fuck about this quack. You, off your ass! Where's Gaspar? Tell her what you know. Nobody gets hurt. I'm sorry, do you work for me or the scabs? Talk for fuck's sake! Oh, fuck! You, Merc! Help me! Nah, not zeroing anyone just because you don't want to use your words. I can't fucking believe this. Gasper's dead. What? You're lying! He was just a little sick! Your brother was so high out of his mind, it scorched his metabolic editor. The kid was in a coma before he even hit the table. Huh? How'd he die? Morphine injection. His remaining implants were at risk, and I've got patients who need them. To hell, your other patients! You... You fucking murderer! Am I hearing this right? You flatlined a patient just to save a few eddies. Me? I profit from none of this. There was nothing I could do. Why delay the inevitable? We'll extract his implants. They'll go to people who still need them. You won't lay a goddamn finger on him. Give me my brother. No! No. What did you say? Fuck! Help! Where's his body? Fuck off, Scav! You need those implants, I get it. Gonna have to find another way. My, how wasteful. Tell Nika where her brother's at, or I donate your chrome myself. Morgue in the storage room. Here's the card. Son of a fucking bitch! You just killed a whole lot of innocent people. Sure you know the feeling. I do. All too well. You know, with your lack of scruples, you could do pretty well over in Night City. Never thought about a career move. A North Oak Villa, Rayfield in the garage, sent some Bloody Mary for breakfast. That life bored me to tears. The patients, what's their status? With Odell, out in the street, waiting. Tell them they can come back in. We need to clean up this mess. Feel sorry for the chick. It's got to weigh heavy on Anderson, too. Guy's got questionable ethics, but what's a doctor to do in Dogtown? Friend, huh? 
Well, I guess you just gotta hang.
Unlocking emergency exit. Hey, hey. Careful with that. I'm linked to the runner. See? are in need of rescue. And who but you could save those sworn to protect Get us? In. Now, these two little piggies went to market, struck a deal with one of Hanson's men, Dodger. What could go Get wrong, in. you think? Correct. Everything. Stella, the fiancé of one of our officers, will fill you in. Best of luck. Stella? Something the matter? Get down. Can't get spotted by Dodger's men. If it makes you feel better. Listen, this is serious, okay? You don't mess with Dodger's people. Okay, <laughs> sure. Pretty comfy, actually, this. Need your help with my fiancé, Bill, and his buddy, Charlie. They're trapped in the building across the street. Hans mentioned they're both NCPD. Both grade A gonks, too. Sometimes do side gigs around town. Wanted to cut a deal with Dodger, but things obviously went south. Bill called me from inside, said only that, and I quote, it's bad. And if I don't get help, Dodger will paint the walls with their brains. Why's Dodger got you all shaking at the knees? 
He's a dealer with close ties to Hansen. Total psycho, too. Moved to Dogtown to avoid serious prison time. Just please try not to wipe Dodger's men. You'll make things go from bad to worse. Take this access card. Dodger took over an abandoned NCPD precinct. Security systems are still up and running, so this should get you in without a hitch. Upsides of last-gen NCPD tech, huh? Save them. Please. There's a switch to the right! Hello? Someone out there? It's V, here to help you guys out. Finally! Bill's losing his fucking mind over here! Okay, let's try to get this open. Fucking slab this thing! Little help! Come on! Jesus fucking Christ! I know. What the fuck? Don't worry. Not my blood. <laughs> the hell happened? Uh, better see for yourself. It's just through here. What in the... This is Bill. Hi. Who's your friend? Uh, oh, me? Just told you, I I'm Bill. Thanks, Bill. Got that. No, I mean the dead fucking body on the table you somehow failed to mention to Stella. We, we, we didn't kill him, okay? We, we, we swear. Let's see. Two blood-soaked dudes locked in a room with a gutted corpse. Yeah, real puzzler. Better take ages for a detective to unravel this one. Go on. Tell him about your genius idea. My idea? You're the one Plan who set up the deal with was Dodger. was rock fucking solid. If only you didn't leave a bag of drugs in front of a junkie! How was I supposed to know he'd swallow it? Cut it out, fellas. Take me through what happened. Oh, you go! No, you! I swear to fucking God. Went like this. Choom over here 
Clips Dodger's shit. Hightails it to NC. We catch wind, Dodger's put out a bounty to bag him. Bring back his nose candy. Bump right into him during a routine stop. Dumb fucking luck. Chum was carrying seven ounces of Sin Coke. So we cuffed him. Took him here. Chum swallowed seven whole ounces? That, that even possible? So we're here, waiting on Dodger, when Bill pops the baggie on the table like it's nothing. All of a sudden, this gonk turd yells, Fuck you, pigs, and stuffs the bag in his mouth. Could've had a food tube implant? Like a deep, wide throat? Yeah, like the one your mom's got. Fuck you even talking about, Bill. Why would he do that? Makes no sense. Fuck if I know. It's not like he made a list of pros and cons. Bag must have broke because he got all foamy at the mouth. Started spazzing out and then just croaked. That's when we started to panic. This fool gulped tens of thousands worth of eddies. What the fuck else are we supposed to do? If the bag already broke, why bother trying to play Operation? We panicked, all right? Shit happens. <sighs> this. It's all gone. Dissolved. And now Dodger's gonna end us. So you bring him the thief who swiped his dope. Only now there's no thief. Or dope. Yeah. It's about the gist of it. You gotta help us get out of here. Alright. Let's get moving. One last tiny thing. Came here in our squad car and, uh... Kinda need it back. Just keeps getting better. Where is it? In the garage. To the garage we it's go. It's official, V. Finally made it to the major leagues. League of first-class leadheads, to be precise. Nice of you to join us, Johnny. Still Always value you. Only if she finds out what we did. I'm a dead man walking. You know what you could use? What? A nice big pair of balls. Oh, cause you're such a tough guy? Not like you stutter in front of the cap every fucking time. I don't fucking stutter. Let us through here before. What was the code again? 2893? It was 2983. Idiot, it was 2893. Saw him punch it. Go on. Didn't work. Ha! <laughs> 2983, I fucking told you. Dodger school. us, okay? Gotta be a switch around here somewhere. Dodger will drown us in eddies, Bill. The plan is foolproof, Bill. Trust me, I know what I'm saying, Bill. <sighs> Shut up, Bill. So what if it's fucking Pacifica? What, too pussy to set foot there, Bill? Afraid of earning some serious scratch? Says the asshole who couldn't keep a bag in his fucking pocket.
squad cars right through here. You do have them, don't you? The keys. Shit. Wait, don't tell me you left them upstairs. Kill, June. Got them right here. Would you look at that? A welcoming party. How thoughtful. Greetings, fellas. Oh, I'm out early. We... Uh, we can explain. Quiet. You I don't know. Care to introduce yourself? Got hired by these two to help. Oh. <laughs> They look like they could use a hand on oh, oh, yo! It's safe to come out. Dodger ain't breathing. Is it over? Yup. Nothing left but hop in your ride and flee the scene. Sure you can manage that much. Thanks. So we going to what? Yeah, yeah. Hey! Thanks again. Okay. I'll radio us in. Tell them we're back. Wait. I'll get Stella on the hollow first. <laughs> Suit yourself. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah, we're, we're just about to. V. So tell me. What did our boys in blue do this time? Swear to Christ, if someone asks me one more time... Prickly today, are we? I'll make do without details. If the client is happy, then so am I. Contract closed. Hey, oh, hang on a sec, Hans. Remember our deal? Yes, the Black Sapphire. I have an entry strategy for you. Foolproof. Meet me at the Heavy Hearts. Okay, be there soon. You there! Father must get back to work now. Okay? Okay. Ah, if it isn't V. V, my favorite Merc. Splendid. What you completed for me significantly shifted the playing field vis-a-vis -vis Hanson. Excellent work, precisely as requested. Maybe the one thing I didn't expect, to see the man behind the hollow curtain. The elusive Mr. Hans in the flesh. Not only did you rescue those clowns in blue, you also managed to eliminate Dodger. Calm, collected, and professional. Bravo. You have proven to be a person I can trust. Hence my decision to drop the veil and meet in person. A rare occurrence, I assure you. Were I to have more virtuosos like you, I wager I'd have more than Dogtown in my grasp. Dogtown, Pacifica, then I'd line up the rest, snort, and it'll be done. Working with bona fide professionals, positively a treat. Gigs you had me do. How will they solve your Hanson sitch? Take a boxer. He can't knock out his opponent. What then? He goes to work on the body. Once his adversary's stamina wanes, he looks for his opening, connects fists with jaw. 
I know it may not seem all that clear from where you stand, but the gigs you have completed will allow me to audaciously shift some of the pawns and figures on the chessboard that is Dogtown. Checkmate is but a few moves away. Take it you prefer Dogtown with no Hansen at the helm. Hansen wields much power, greedily so. He's also clever. These traits I tolerate, even value, when occurring in isolation. But all at once, no. Especially not in one who grips an entire district in the palm of his hand. It makes business... trying. And arrest you in some tea. It's my own blend. Sure, why not? So, how did this combat zone become Dogtown? Do you know? Heard this and that. Something to do with the war? 2069. Colonel Hansen led an operation colorfully called Midnight Storm. The objective? to occupy this combat zone and establish an NUSA staging ground in Night City. Soon after, the sides agreed to a ceasefire. Hansen's force was left to fend for itself. Headquarters, the public, everyone feigned ignorance, pretending Hansen and company were never here. But our good colonel decided to put down roots. He declared this combat zone an NUSA territory. In our terms, he carved out an enclave for himself and went from soldier to arms dealer overnight. Marooned he was. Two weeks for a bullet to reach his brain, everyone thought. But his brain remained intact, and he became a force to be reckoned with. A man whose existence is a threat to many is a dangerous man indeed. Let's table politics for now, huh? Go straight to biz. Business. Hmm. Of course. The Black Sapphire. Hanson stronghold, guarded by elite soldiers. Military quarters are situated on lower levels, while top floors are a decadent haven for the ultra-rich. The building's blueprint was not easily procured, I should say. Hansen guards his hotel secrets as if they were an embarrassing rectal itch. But, given a will, ways are usually found. You help a client of mine, they reciprocate. And I gain latitude. Quid pro quo in full effect. The building plans are yours. I'll even throw in vulnerabilities to watch for. A token of my appreciation. And, though this goes without saying, the data, its source, are completely secure. No one knows you have it. Data leaks, or lack thereof, are the difference between myself and, say, the late Mr. Deshawn. The Shard. Black Sapphire Info and Blueprints. All nooks and crannies. I trust it's all you need to waltz in and perform your planned pirouettes. Yet a word of caution. Even fully prepared, you'll be marching into a pit full of vipers. Watch your step. Tick tock. Thanks, and time. I only hope this won't mark the end of our collaboration. Truth be told, a few new assignments seem imminent. Let me guess. More local politico gaming? Activity is abundant in Dogtown, and behind closed doors, plots and schemes. Should change ever occur, as it inevitably must, someone really ought to pave the way for a smooth transition. Be looking forward to those new gigs, then. You will hear from me soon. This, I guarantee you. And V, whatever happens at the Black Sapphire, make sure you come back alive, hmm?
You're going where local and international politics mix. Strong currents, both. Make sure to plant my feet firmly, then. Later, hands. Data shard from hands. A golden ticket into the Black Sapphire. Perfect. Send it to him. No worries. This connection is secure. Catch. It's on its way. And reception complete. I'll pass it on to Alex. And as soon as you're ready, join us at the mod. I'm not there when you arrive. Relic? Gets worse every day. Time I have left is evaporating quick. You experience them often? These attacks? Don't really keep count, but never know if the next one won't be my last. No shit. Dad's breathing down my neck. Always. I know what that feels like. Being a dead man walking? Exactly. I never talked about this, you know. I should be saying they tried to kill me, but sometimes it feels like they actually succeeded. Tell me more. Ambush. Attempt on my life seven years back. Yeah, you said. What exactly happened there, Reed? I landed in the ICU, where I waited for some Arasaka goon to come finish me off. I was betrayed by our people, the FIA. I say betrayed, but I was sold out. Part of a deal, a peace offering, my head on a silver platter, all for a ceasefire. Peace comes at a price. Someone's always got to pay it. Come on, 
I'm gonna show you something. Hang on. They set you up. Yet here you are working for him again. Even deep wounds stop hurting eventually. Scar over. A few years on, they're just a niche. Let's go. Let's ride down. Where we headed? On a little trip down memory lane. To see some old junk. I still can't believe Alex decided the best place for a ball is right over our old safe house. She's always had a twisted sense of humor. Where's she at? Waiting downstairs? She's finishing up recon in town. We should make ourselves at home until she gets back. It's been dark for seven years, this place. Let's brighten things up again. The end of any war is never pretty. Both sides race to tie up loose ends. A car bomb blew up one of my crew. Another was poisoned. A third got shot in the back of the head while buying a pack of smokes. A couple others just vanished without a trace. Every night we waited for Arasaka agents to come finish us off. I had to make a choice. I chose to dig our heels in. I thought we still had a fighting chance. It was bold. It was stupid. A mix of both. Maybe I just didn't know how to walk away. Let it rest. Or maybe I don't know how to lose. Either way, we managed to save a few more agents. The price for that was yours truly. Say what you want, but sounds like they stabbed you in the back, plain and simple. Saving many of my people in the process. You play grown-up games, you face grown-up consequences. Funny. Out of everyone, it was Songbird they asked to pull the trigger. Wait. Yeah. Pulled the trigger, as in literally took out her iron and shot you. Not personally, but she unlocked the door for those who came and did. I was leaving the city, heading home. Songbird was still here, in this very room, in fact. It was guiding me on comms, led me straight into a trap. Neutralizing me. My last assignment in Night City. Then she got a ticket home. You're now trying to save her. Why? Because it's the right thing to do. I had plenty of time to examine this under a microscope. Under focus, some things sharpen, others blur. But there comes a point when you just cut through the bullshit and see what's in front of you. Songbird is still my people, and nothing can change that. Fuck, Reed. Now, my is is a whole nother story. But Songbird, no. I got nothing against her. So why Myers? I miss anything? Some reminiscing. So good, let's get this show going. I checked up on Slider's contention. Fucking had it right, it turns out. I dove into old mission files wherever Somi was involved. They were buried deep, near impossible to access, even with my clearance. Each and every one, the Blackwall. All authorizations, mission orders, personally signed by one person, Rosalind Myers. 
Wouldn't want to be in her shoes if that shit floats to the top. The NUS is a small country governed by a woman with highly ambitious goals. Sometimes those ambitions went out of reason. But that's not something we need to pour over now. Alex, what do you have for us? Oh, little of this, little of that. We'll plan in a sec. Say, V. Like playing fancy dress up? What's it matter? Gotta do what needs doing. Preferences be damned. All right, a little sourpuss. Managed to learn that some pop megastar is gonna grace the party with a show. Guest list? Expect everybody who's anybody. That includes you. Gonna don fancy outfits and rub shoulders with VIPs. Be warned though, fancy doesn't mean easy. Ready for the deets, V? Let me hear him. Black Sapphire, the most heavily guarded place in Dogtown. Doesn't mean security's airtight, though. V, you're gonna enter through a flooded tunnel system. Got a top-of-the-line diving suit, ought to fit you snug as a glove. Water's maybe a little super toxic. So yeah, be careful. What about Reed? Was just about to mention, he'll be there too, of course. Already know what the hotel looks like. Really, really hard to miss. Flooded tunnels here. That's your way inside. Now focus. You'll reach a terminal at the end. Jack in and breach the cams, giving Reed his window to slip into the building. You'll take different elevators up, here. Saul will open a passage to his side. For you ask, yeah, it's the only way. Area could be heavily guarded, so you'll have to be on your tippy toes. Couldn't get clean intel, so you'll just have to be creative. Improvise. You're gonna meet here. Soon as you meet up, you'll doll up like it's prom night and go to the ball. That's where you'll rendezvous with Songbird. All clear? Yup. Prem. Okay, let's talk gear. Take your time. Grab anything you think might be useful. A surprise awaits you in the box. This your iron? Sure is. Her Majesty's been itching to return to active duty. It'd be an honor. What did he want in return for the favor he did us? Wanted to test the waters, see which way the currents are flowing. Hanson's dominance over Dogtown doesn't benefit Hans know-how, so he's out to level the playing field. Politics. It's the same shit wherever you go. You know, if not for you, we'd have no way of getting into the Black Sapphire reaching Sombird. It's good to have you on our side. I mean, Evie. That it? We sit? I believe we are. I'll hang back a while, and then meet you there. Place stinks of memories, huh? A little dusty. The world is up. What are we gonna do with it?
city, honey. Copy. Made it to the hallway. Copy you loud and clear. I'm in position too. Claustrophobic. I figured out the patrol routes, got them down. Set myself a safe path through and past them. What's the 
message. See a gate, two guards. Don't worry about them. Jimmy, open that gate. There you go. What else can I say? Ross, if you were ever really in downtown, we have ready to have a quiet elevator access. Come right to the top. Get moving. I'll meet you there. Roger that. Dropped the sniper, nesting in his perch now. Had the perfect vantage point, saw everything. Cover me. You're in prime duck hunting position. New user detected. Calibration in progress. Firing mode inactive. I'm in position. Do you have- I got you. What now? We do this nice and quiet if we can, got it? Spot any guards in my way, give me a heads up. Don't worry, boss. Rifle sports a silencer if it comes to that. Better look around. Cam's galore here. Should have access once the sniper's nest completes calibration. Good. They could prove useful. Healthy smattering of guards along your path. Copy that. We'll take them out one by one. Best if they never knew we were here. See the main elevator shaft. Too risky. There'll be sentries up top. Keep an eye on it, though. See a bunch of containers. You could use them to get to your side. Yeah, see them too. Let me build that bridge. There's a service elevator nearby, we'll take that up. Gotta get there first though, cover me. Calibration complete. Firing mode active. Don't see anything, path's clear. I'm going. Contact! We've been spotted. After blast, I'll wait. I go to your scope. Man down! Take that place! Fuck! I got a few bogeys on my six!
That up like a bunch of rookies, but there's no going back. Elevator, follow me. Almost there, V. Fucking finally. You're looking a little pale. Yeah, well, you didn't almost drown today. Are you sure you're okay? I'm fine. You scanning me? Your cortisol level spiked up. Geez, easy, Chum. I'm fine. Really. You babysit Alex and saw me like this, too? At times. How many ops you been on? Ballpark. One of the number of years you've been around. But right now, we're crashing the party of a bad boy dictator. While aiming to walk out with his prized possession. Dress up time. Throw on your new threads and plaster on your best fake smile. A party awaits. set. Gotta hand it to Hanson, V. Party's hopping. Has a sense of grandeur. Didn't have shit. Say again? Hop on over there Maintenance area? Out. Where exactly? Wounded or do we have bodies? Welcome. Would you care for a beverage? This is campaign. Investigation. What 
What now? I know as much as you do. All she said was to come here. She'll either find us, or she left us something. And you? What's your play? I think I'm starting to feel the vibe. Just remember what we're here for. To my right, Booth's far back, behind the stairs. The guy in the fatigues. Looks like he came here straight from a firing range. Owner of the Black Sapphire, Mr. D-Town himself, Kurt Hansen. Clearly having a great night in the company of the NCPD commissioner. PA Broadcast. He fiercely anti-law enforcement. It's an act. Behind closed doors, he's rubbing elbows and patting backs of NCPD's top brass. Avoid him, especially in the confrontation. Beside that, stay visible. Songbird said she'd find us here. Let's give her a chance. I'll grab a drink and look around. Open line on comms. Don't press anyone too hard. We need to keep up appearances. Look like you're having fun. Gin and tonic, please. Say, hey, are you looking for a friend? You're supposed to be here. Okay. Was your friend at the moon? Song saw me. Korean lady. Around 30. Hmm. Haven't seen her around. Was she alone? Enjoy. No. No, she's with Colonel Hansen. Thanks. But he's in sight with other people in the home. She ain't with me. Yeah, I can see that. That one on me later, yeah? Sorry. I can't let you go any me, further. Sir. Don't mind if I do. A pleasant evening to you. Here's the deal. Either we get some proof of purchase, or there's another. Not a fight. Salud, amigo. Appreciate it. Thanks. Meaning what exactly? Gets fucked up on Hansen's dime, then puke all over his carpets. Respect. Discuss this at the later time. V, it's good you're here. Not what you expected, huh? Is it the haircut? Dress looks good on you. Thank you. 
That was the surprising bit, I'm sure. It's so good you're here. Don't know what I'd do without you, V. Really. Didn't exactly give me a choice now, did you? Told me to show up here and just ghost it. The, uh, runner. Your friend. Who, who helped us reconnect last time. Killed him. Fried him, didn't I? Well, I could say we brought death to his door. Guess the two of us just lucked out. I ran out of time. To explain... Everything. Saul. I've made... So many mistakes. It's alright, son. Not your fault. The blame's on us. All of it. On you? I is all of them. I know what they made you do. They pushed and pushed and I... I wasn't there to stop it. Listen, guys. We do not have the time for this now. Right. Main thing is to get you out of here. That's... not happening. It is. We got in, we can get out. Just Not the me. point. I'm... dying, Saul. Like V. Hansen has the cure we need. We run now, we both die. Relic's killing V. Blackwall's my poison. I can't bow out now. Got a plan. Hear it in your voice. Yeah. One I can't hope to enact without your help. Hansen pulled some tech out of a bunker under Dogtown. Tech that could cure both V and me. We need to clep it. Only way I see of doing that is to stay close. Play the prisoner. So oh, fuck. We'll wait for an opportunity and pounce. I'll be on the inside, ask for your help when the time's right. I can flee once I have that tech. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Ah, so me. Care to introduce your friends? It's not often I'm simply not familiar with guests attending my own party. And I never forget a face. Kurt Hansen. Name's V. Just V. Haven't seen so me in years. Trying to catch up. Oh, that's what this is. To me, reunions consist of picking up the broken, scattered shards of your heart. Or teeth. Always hurts. Well, I need to grab you, darling. I have a couple NC politicos here who are dying to meet you. And if we're to keep hungry rats from devouring Dogtown, we really do need to feed them the occasional scraps. I'm all yours, Kurt. See you soon, V. Oof. Praying it worked. Reestablished our link the moment I touched you. Interesting. I need a minute to process. And I need a drink. Heading downstairs. I'll explain everything. Just need you to listen. Lied to me, Song. Said you had the cure. No mention of a fuckload of flaming hoops I gotta jump through to get it. It was no trick. Just didn't tell you the whole story. V, I... I can't explain everything now. It's... too much. But I really do need your help. All I want is to get that cure for us. It's what I've been chasing all along. The cure. How do we get it? We need the Neural Matrix. Secret tech that incorporates AIs from beyond the Black Wall. The Matrix is nested in a mainframe Hansen pulled out of the bunker. The mainframe's secured, but Hansen lacks the key. That's the problem. Got a plan. Spill it. Hansen needs me and a duo of runners who worked on this tech in the past. They actually grabbed access codes they're willing to unload for a price. Classic black market shit. 
They're bringing access, I'm bringing know-how about how to pull the Matrix and data off the mainframe. We're to work side by side, giving us a chance. You clip the access codes, then get the runners out of the way. You'll then impersonate them for a meet with Hansen. Say meet or we'll swipe the Matrix out from under his nose. I think I got it. Our targets, where we find them. They're here. Downstairs. Red-headed twins, walled to the teeth with ice. Crochet scans will show you bunk. Green. Noted. Anything else? Champagne glass over there. Prep some intel for you. Get it to read. You'll need it later. Really need to go now, B. I'm counting on you. Songbird? Right. Okay. Seems your special agent has special needs. Trying to drown his sins and sorrows. Talk to Songbird via the relic. We can communicate again. Hmm. Y'all good there, Reed? Yeah. I just need to process for a minute. It's just how I'm built. A little adversity and I need a few moments to think. Come up with anything? Yeah. We now know who took a swipe of Myers's head. Hanson. Yeah, but not really. Don't know about you, but I see coincidences as patterns. Structures we have yet to recognize. Hmm, <laughs> what you driving at? SF-1 crashes. Not anywhere, but over specific turf. Controlled by someone who found some obscure forgotten tech in a secret bunker. Right. Crash was an inside job. We suspected that from the get-go. Now we know it was. And we know it was Songbird. She was behind it. And it took you just one drink to cobble that together. Started seeing the pieces falling into place up on the mezzanine. So we told her she's dying. Things follow from that. She made a deal with Hanson earlier. Had to. Before any of this went down. Traded the president's life for access to the tech. If there's truth to this, Song's guilty of high treason. Her and her actions, I won't judge. Not my place. As I see it, Somi was playing both sides, simultaneously spinning deals with Hansen and you. She has hands and set. Then you come in. She contacts you via the relic, asks you to rescue the president. Absolution for her right there. You need to cure just as much, guaranteeing you'll help if her plan falls through. And here we are. Yeah, and here we are, rushing to Songbird's rescue. Thinking a few steps ahead was always her strength. But judgment calls and situational assessment, her Achilles heel. As a chess master, she'd be famous for dazzling plays and excruciatingly beautiful defeats. I still trust her. Trust she'll keep her word. Promise me the cure, and I fully intend to get it. Only thing that matters, really. I'd be careful. Mind sharp. Eyes and ears attuned. But I know Somi well enough to know she'll do her damnedest to be fair. So, what are you thinking about all this? I'm not convinced so means to blame for everything. In this trade, nothing's ever as it seems. You gotta keep asking questions till you get to the bottom of it. That's experience talking. Main thing now is to get her out of this cesspool of a sitch. Then we'll see which direction to take.
Right. No point pouring over it now. Right. Back to the Sitchin head. What do we have to do to save her? To grab the tech Songbird and I both need, we gotta go to a meet with Hansen. Prep for it's required. Cause we show up as a pair of runners. We need to collect their identities first. Whatever that means. Personality imprint theft. Sounds like our Colombian job of yore. Who are they and where do we find them? Song got this shard to me. Take a look. Our targets are a brother and sister, red-haired twins. They're here somewhere, schmoozing. Hmm. Okay, we need to pull data, get samples of assorted behavior. We make contact with them, talk, scan as we talk. Got it, I think. So, time to make our move? Over there. Twin roulette, looks like. Alex, you copy that? Radio loud and clear. Prep and scan tech now. You're new to this, but relax. We'll do it as a four-hander. I scan one, you handle the other. Alex will pilot us through. V, zipping funds your way from our operating budget. Load up on chips and join their game. Just don't go all in from the get-go. We stagger our approach, and we're strangers. Let's get to this. Struck gold with roulette, really. Gambling throws people around, high and low, brings the joy of winning and the despair of defeat. Perfect for our purposes. Greetings, sir. Want to buy some chips? Of course. Good luck at the tables. Understood. Will you join us? Five. Odd. Red. Place your bets, please. Bedding's open. By all means. Make it red. Relax. Buy him drinks, break the ice. I'll join you momentarily. All bets are in. Bedding is closed. What? No introduction? V. You. Aurore Cassel. And that boar is my brother, Emmerich. What's your poison? My treat. A bourbon for me. Alas, mon frère does not drink. You heard the lady. And real water for the gentleman here. And what'll you have? Hard liquor, please. Whiskey. Inori okay with you? Japanese? More than fine. Your drinks will be here shortly. Realized. Uh, you must have dirt beneath your fingernails too, like all these bastards and bitches. That is, unless you're a tourist, like the no-lifers who must watch others live to feel anything. Provocative, this one. What do you think I am? Oh my my! One drink and already flirting? Bold. Thirty. Even. Red. Ah, yes. Duh! Fucking done here! Duh! <sighs> Place your bets, please.
Can't help feeling I interrupted something when I walked up. Do not worry yourself about this. Oh, come, come. V is just being cordial. N'est-ce pas, V? You weren't snooping just Three. now, were you? Odd. Red. Still no sign from Reed, V. Got a sinking feeling about this. Place your bets, please. Ah, he got me. Aren't you big time? But in my defense, <laughs> you guys stand out. Even in a crowd like this one. Oh, really? Listening to conversations of strangers can be... Dangerous. Sometimes you can hear more than you can handle. Listen, Reed's MIA for now, can't wait for him. Gotta do both scans on your own. We were discussing local politics, specifically our host, Monsieur Kurt Hansen. Big fish selling big guns for big money. Yet here you have celebrities, politicians, even the chief of police. So I was thinking, uh, perhaps Hansen would do better by being a veritable businessman, no? I claim he would. Mon cher frère disagrees. 21. Odd. Red. Ugh. Guess it's not my lucky day. Place your bets, please. Who is Kurt Hansen really? A crucial question. Tread carefully with that duo, V. Hansen's a suit without a suit, if you catch my drift. Oh my fucking god, you Americans. You used to have more imagination. Tossing you around, V. Don't let her. Level the field. Maybe you could lay out your opinion of the man. Profiter de la vie, to enjoy life, that is the point. You can wage wars to make money, but why do so at all if you must then hide it? Emmerich knows this, I know this. And if Hansen has any sense, he knows it too. Nine. Odd. Red. Place your bets, please. Tu ne serais pas en train de devenir trop pote avec lui Mais fais pas ton jaloux, petit frère C'est pas comme si Anne allait baiser, lui et moi Charming little show you're putting on. You see, Amrik We are charming I mean, Hansen could take Dog down by the throat, eject the junkies, and make it a paradise for billionaires. Just getting rich is dull. You should work for the community. Invest, create jobs, throw banquettes. She's getting chatty. Doing good, Fee. And charities are excellent washing machines. You launder billions, believe me. Ten. Even. Black. Place your bets, please. And you're so childish. It's beautiful. What? Hansen going missionary position in business? Nonsense. <sighs> Reed's still not responding. But you keep working it. Let's go. Swap twins. This is right, you know. Legit biz. Lots better. Safer than the gangster shit. Oh, please. What would he do? Build homes? Strip malls? He is very good at what he does. A professional criminal. Soldier yesterday, crime lord today. Why not biz shark tomorrow? Yet he is a businessman. And to make it legal? It is a lot of work to do for a simple change of label. Good. Little worms opening up. Nineteen. Odd. Red. Oh, putain! Place your bets, please. Care to expand? Floor is yours. Allow me to say, V. Arms or property, it would make no difference to me what I sell. 
and to spend five years on efforts to uh, change how people see you, call you, to be upstanding in the eyes of others. I could not give a shit. 23. Odd. Red. Ah, damn. I should have bet on red. Place your bets, please. Getting there. Almost got it. Give me something big now. Make them laugh or cry, I don't care. Please. How about we go all in? Bet everything we want tonight. <gasps> and we play different colors, yes? You win or we do. And either you or we lose all. My thoughts exactly. A moment. You join the table. Buy drinks, talk and talk. Now you wish to risk everything? I find this disquieting. Perhaps you could now tell us about yourself. Tread lightly. Name's V. Afterlife affiliated. Make what you will of it. Oh, are you happy now? You choose first then. Black's my choice. Oh, we are red. As our hair. A luscious color. Allez, 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 allez! Eight. Even. Black. Putain de merde! Leave us for a moment, if you please. Congratulations to you. I know your friend Reed is FIA. My natural assumption is, you're an agent too. I'm also guessing you two took it upon yourselves to save the president, then exfil her out of Dogtown. I should send you back to Night City in body bags, filled with pieces. Wow, you cracked it. Clever man. To be honest, I got tired of the media circus. All the allegations thrown in my face, the bullshit propaganda. Luckily, we can put all that behind us now. Oh, so you couldn't be happier we saved Myers after your botched hit. Right. Think you believe that less than I do. I will let you and Reed walk free of this place. In one piece. On your own two feet. Consider it a gesture of my goodwill. Your little bird came to me on her own, though. She was tired of breaking international laws on the President's whim. She simply had to run away. Breaching the Black Wall, jeopardizing the net, all humankind's safety in fact, for personal gain? I wonder what Netwatch would say. Pass it on to President Myers. Also tell her, her toy of mass destruction is my friend now. And she should get the fuck out of my backyard, or the world will learn about her games. I've matters to attend to. You'll find Mr. Reed downstairs. Okay, V. Got all we need. Okay, what do I do now? Haul ass out of there. Son of a bitch said I'd find Reed downstairs. Yeah, heard him. Wasn't crazy about his tone. Time to evac Let's not tempt the face. Head to the elevator, ride down to one. No, You're going to eat something, Lizzie. No buts.
No need to worry. Routine verification. Please enjoy your evening. Is something happening? Hmm. People are checking. Have you noticed anything like Thinking about what that prick said. Guy knows. Got some dirt on Myers. Can't imagine it happening. But if the public learns that any U.S. president willingly broke international laws governing cyberspace use... And USA's fucked. Myers will either have to take the fall, let herself be buried in dirt for this, or she'll defy the world and spark another war. Fuck me. Songbird's a walk and talk in WMD. Hanson's got her on a tight leash. And he can prime her for use whenever he wants. Listen, V. We need to get her out. For everyone's sake. Oh, just once I'd like to see things go smoothly, as planned. This feels so very, very wrong. You and your chum best be headed the fuck out now. Straight on from here, gonna walk you two out. Come on, V. No reason to hang. Move it! Let's go! I'm going, I'm going. Sheesh. That's right, you are. And no funny biz while you're at it. Hey, hold the fuck up. Are you the ones who busted your way in? Through them tunnels like eels or something. Hey, uh, got us confused with someone else, man. Yeah. Yeah, it's you. You took out some of my tunes. We fucking served together. Maybe Hansen let you walk. But we won't. And since he is not here, who knows what's gonna happen. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. Know how you feel. Do you? Get the fuck out of my face! Or you can stick around. Get down on all fours, twerk it, and work it. Good boy. Norm will be out in moments. Wasn't that hard, hmm? It's your lucky day, you two-faced shits. Fuck Follow out of me. here. How'd things go, V? Got everything. All set. You got thorough scans of the runners. Both of them. Yourself. I said... We got everything. Well, well. And then you, uh, excused yourself. Stepped away. Disappeared? Hansen showed up. We chatted. Threats were made, actually. Said if Myers doesn't let up, the world will learn about Songbird Pierce and the Black Wall. He clearly knows what Somi means to the President. Personal WMD, you mean? Yeah. Hansen knows all. Need to get her the fuck out, Reed. Really. I was afraid of this. Okay. P, Alex and I have work. We need to analyze the data from Songbird. Might take a day or two. Preem. Open comms line then? Sure. We'll work out a game plan. Get back to you ASAP. Oh, and V, bang up work.
be. Recon's in our rear view now. Get yourself ready and meet me at Alex's. Sure. See you there. What you got in stock? There's food and drink Dogtown's got to offer, huh? Convo? Ah, uh, V, you're here. It's about time, too. We're nearly done finalizing the plan. And? How's progress? Just a small difference of opinion to I know. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's Not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. Story for another time, maybe. I agree. Come on, let me show you what we have. Parse the intel from the shard Somi gave him. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want to run. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here's your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. She was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Alex nailed it. If anyone's to blame, it's Myers, not you. You might be right, but so am I. Right, our objective, to free Somi from under Hans' duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue op, because... Well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall. A consequence of her service to the NUS and President Myers. I'm not about to pretend I understand the tech whys and how. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, it'll kill her. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. All right. Plan. Let me hear it. Hanson to meet with the net runners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close to Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know its security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hanson access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hanson's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural Matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now we just need to take those twins out of the equation. So we kidnap them. How we want to do this? They're driving a rental wide in NC. An exploitable opening. We're going to track their ride and hijack it. Before they reach Hanson at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Addicts will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavioral imprints are tuned already. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hansen. Right. Where you'll sell them the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. 
Gonna disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Sounds like Flatline and Hansen set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the NUS. And Songbird? We have to rescue him. Myers told you as much yourself. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. So, time we talk nabbing the runners? Cover that in a minute. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far. Near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. So, breach the station, trace the car. Good. What then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Sounds simple enough. Tech worth tens of thousands can help any plan go off like a dream. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it. Just great. Got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. 
Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. So let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed as soon as you grab that encryption key. <sighs> Looking for something? Won't find it here. Nothing to Borked. It ain't working? Jesus! You want a hint? I can tell you how to fix it if you really want to fix it. Old people need help with this stuff sometimes. So, yeah, turn it off first, then turn it back on. You know, I can tell you where to look for the on button for a thousand ads. Interested? Thanks, but no thanks. Be fine on my own. Sure, sure. Yeah, totally. What about ten? I'll help you for ten ads, too. Okay, Eddie's are all yours. Nova. Done deal. So? Switch. Where is it? I don't know exactly. Around here. Telling you where to look, not where to find it. Just like I said. We'll play hot and cold. If you're close or far, we'll holler hot or cold. Let's start playing. You'll get it. What the fuck? My BD! No! And the best fucking bit, too! Jankass power grid? <laughs> yo, yo, yo! Don't even think about flatlining here! I'm gonna touch a corpse! Uh, uh, this... Uh, this gotta uh, be what having a fucking stroke feels like. Perfect, Johnny. Thanks. Wasn't on purpose. Just gotta pick up the pace. Clock's ticking. I'm doing what I can. Spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. 
means a lot to me. It could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. Swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. Yearning to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you miss something, it's usually too late. Attack on Myers. You schemed it up with Hansen. I know that. Yeah. Neural Matrix was pricey. But honestly, I... I never thought he'd try to kill her. He betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix. And for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. It fucked everything up. I know, V. But I had no choice. Still don't understand why. Wasn't any other way. Honestly. Wouldn't have resorted to this if there was. From Myers, the NUSA, um, just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. weapons and tools. They don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Sounds... Sounds painfully familiar. Think I know how you feel. I doubt anyone understands this feeling as well as you do, V. You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, you feel the same way about me? Feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah. With you and myself. I need to get away. From Kurt, then USA, Reed. From everything. Night City's just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved. Or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission, grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then? Um... 
You helped me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the Matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... that's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? Should be pretty clear. I mean to survive, too. I appreciate your honesty. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hansen. So me contacted me. Got news. Let me hear it. Well, first off, we've been greenlit. Our VIPs ready to be served. Music to my ears. What else? Songbird opened up a bit. About her sitch. It's looking bad. <laughs> Real bad. This tech's her only shot. I hear you. I do. All the more reason to focus on the mission in front of us. Get our hands on that cure. But read. But so many spilled. We really, really need to talk. I know, but later. Not a topic for the hollow. We need one other thing. We need new chrome. An implant that accommodates behavioral imprints. Send you the for a clinic. The doc will be expecting you. Just tell the Ripper you know she collects unification war trinkets. So know you came with my blessing. <laughs> Not in Dogtown. Taxes? Who the fuck needs them? In Dogtown, I keep your business safe as long as you abide by my rules. Is that fair to you? Frida? Yes, I do closed. Name's V. That means nothing to me. I'm not taking any new customers. Sorry to inconvenience you. Got something might interest you. I doubt it. Here you collect trinkets. Unification warrior. Mm-hmm. Come in. Do you know why we have rules? Procedures? To goddamn follow them? V, good to see you. Huh. Here to see me? Things are in flux. Situation's changing faster. I thought we should talk. I'm here about Somi. I spent hours wrapping my head around this. Putting myself in her shoes. I needed to understand what she must have been going through to... To resort to treason. 
You're in no position to want to stand, Reed. Your life ain't on a timer. But I know death. Stared him in the eyes up close. She's trapped. Not just here and now, but going months back. Hell. Actually years. I blame Myers, a sore loser. Does her damnedest to avoid it. Songbird, the black wall, dirty tricks meant to give her a competitive edge. It's no wonder Somi doesn't trust anyone. Except maybe you. A little. There's a prison cell prepped and waiting for her already. Somi knows that full well. She lives to see tomorrow and every day after. That's what matters. Myers needs her life, sure, but forgive and forget the attempt on her life? Never. Myers might not forgive her, but doesn't mean I can. Coming from a federal agent? Saying you want to get her home doesn't sound so warm and fuzzy. I will get her home. Exactly how remains to be seen. Okay. We break the chain Hanson wrapped around her neck. Then what? We stow away somewhere safe, ask some questions, establish some common ground. Once I get the answers I'm looking for, I'll personally help it disappear. From everyone, everywhere, including Myers. Say I believe you. Where's your plan go from there? I got contacts in Europe. We'll find the best clinic, put you two back together, fix what's broken. Once we have your cure in hand. But I need to help Somi first. She's lost, and I'm concerned she doesn't know what she's doing. You don't trust her? What I don't trust is the shit from beyond the black wall and the attendant paranoia. Both in play here, I'm afraid. She has another plan in mind. I'm damn sure of it. Read you loud and clear. So what's it all mean next? I have something for you. Our best minds in D.C. cooked it up. Icebreaker. Silver bullet against any fortified netrunner. Farida will feed it into your system during surgery. Use that, and Somi will drop unconscious within a minute. We can't take any chances, and when she wakes up, she'll wake up at home. Okay. How do I use it? Fire it up when you're both jacked into the mainframe. At that moment, Somi's door will be wide open. Sure hope you haven't botched this. Well, that's a hope we share then. Right now, we're focusing on saving your lives. Talking time will come later. It's time I was on my way. I leave you in Farida's able hands. Call me once you're done here. The sooner we begin, the sooner we finish. Okay, no time to lose. Tush, meet chair. Okay, anesthesia incoming. Don't worry, it's the good stuff. Relax and submit. An ID modding implant is complicated tech, true. But the procedure is surprisingly simple. This tech... I actually heard about it. Back at Arasaka Counter Intel. We thought it got the chopper prototype stage. As you can see, it yet lives. Chatterbox. Okay. Anesthesia is taking hold.
how many fingers my holding up. <laughs> nice to see you in good form. Mm -hmm. You want something from me? To chat. Got no other options. You'll have to do. So tell me, what's it feel like to be a traitor? Come on, you know this is a lose-lose clusterfuck of a sitch. I ain't here by choice. At least you see that. Means they haven't turned you yet. Not completely. Come on, got iron in your hand. Gotta put it to someone's head. Pull the trigger. The master spy and the agent unloosed. Tragedy, comedy, or both. Reed, I understand, but I don't get what you have against her. Let's just say I know where they're both coming from. Survival. It's her be-all and end-all. That and she's a walking, talking nuke. The kind that keeps making mistakes, never knowing which one's gonna set her off. And Reed? Bastard and me are one and the same. If I hadn't ghosted the army, I'd have become a Reed myself. Live and die by our principles. That's the tragedy, V. Someone's gonna play victim to the other's good intentions. Try not to forget that when you're standing over that fucking overgrown neuro drive. Some help you've been. Just don't do anything either of us will regret later. Not you, not me. And don't kid yourself. Both of them need you, but neither trusts you. Well done. The facial morph implant is online. Now all you need is a behavioral imprint. And do me a favor. Don't tell me what you need this for. Thanks for everything. Uh-huh. Right. Tracking me in Dogtown? No, no, not you, the car, Liz. I'll explain, but first, you gotta bring her to me. Flipping you the corpse. Hey, procedure's a wrap. V, Hogan not feeling too raw post for Rita's work. It's time to intercept and plan the networks. Just one hiccup. Our access to Karen Exotics was cut. They must have discovered us. Wait, seriously? So we lost them? Not entirely. We know they were last in the city center. Get it out direction. Find a vantage point near the entrance of Dogtown. You'll grab a trace on the runners as they drive to the meeting. The hospital and its staff will be operating under our protection. 
Any stitches? A new leg? Report directly to Dr. Robertson. Over and out. Okay, now I'm gonna need you to confirm a visual for me. Scan the vehicles in your area. One's bound to be there. Visual on our targets. See a convoy. Hansen's goons. Doubt the runners would have a security escort, though. I'll keep watching. Additional support for the stadium, most likely. Clean so far. Still nothing. Got a total Cortez blocking the road. Traffic's piling up. Car's basic, run of the mill. Definitely not them. And we keep looking. Couple of bikers. Don't expect they'd swap out four wheels for two last minute. Not this style. On to the next. There they are. No question. Both runners are inside. Got the signal? Got it. Not gonna slip off our radar anymore. Good work. Still early for the Beatman heads. Mm. They'll stop. Kill time somewhere. What? Okay, they're stationary. And out of the car. You a driver? It's just fucking stupid. V, you're clear to head for the car. Don't write Get you. Chum rammed your bumper up my ass. Who, who are you hauling for? <laughs> sure as shit is. Give me your deeds so I know who's paying for this damage. You will get it, but my deeds will find you. so far. Car's cam feeds are mine. Good. Last check now. Make sure you're ready to roll. Good, just give me one sec. Why? What are you doing? Tweaking the ice. Kinda half-baked, the way it's set up now. Fine. Just no unnecessary risks. And... 
And done. Kurt Hansen, tu l'as vu, non Il était grave en train de me reloquer au saphir. Oh, à moins que ce soit cette putain de gueule de bois. Oh, ça tourne de partout, dans tous les sens. T'en penses quoi de Hansen, je veux dire. Ok, V, take control. Hold on. Eavesdropping a bit. Could get interesting. Oh, il a foutu le feu au cul de tout le monde quand il a abattu cet avion. Le risque est élevé, oui. Mais ce travail paie bien. On fait notre part. Ensuite, on disparaît. Oh, putain de gueule de bois de sa mère! Il a fallu que tu fasses ça aujourd'hui. Je t'avais dit de pas ouvrir cette dernière bouteille. Hey, you copy. La voiture, quelqu'un en a pris le contrôle. Emric, sonne l'alarme On a besoin d'aide Je vais localiser le vecteur. Ok, une seconde C'est fait Putain, allez J'essaie de reprendre le contrôle Wipe them. What do you think we would do? Bind their hands with duct tape, shove socks in their mouths, and wait for them to wriggle free and call for help? This ain't no game, V. It's a simple choice. Them or us. I chose us. It's a game! Your fucking spy game! They weren't playing! They were innocent! That's not quite how I describe two pro criminals. These innocents, as you call them, wouldn't hesitate to rob you for everything you've got, or put a bullet in your back. Alright, we have fresh disguises already, but you still need to lift the access codes off them. Aurora's the one to check for those.
taking the wheel. V, behavioral imprint, now! This on? Oh shit, my voice! Oh nice! Hang on, that's me! What the hell? Prim, right? Give it a whirl. Introduce yourself. Okay. Here goes. Emmerich Cassel. That it? Well, yeah. Well, sounded like him at least. It can feel like a real trip at first. But you'll get used to it. Take a sec, collect yourself, then we move. Hansen's waiting. Alex, it just hit me. This will be our last stop together. I haven't forgotten our deal. My eyes green litter. A diplomatic mission. No end date. Call it early retirement. Thanks much, Reed. Okay, let's get to it. All right, stadium then. See you there. How about a little refresher before we arrive? Remember, name's Amérique Cassel. Let me let you in on my secret about how to be someone else. Ask yourself three questions. What do they fear? What do they want? What's their deepest secret? Got that? Don't answer now, just something to keep in mind. And be him. So, Emeric, tell me, your thoughts on Hansen? He is a byproduct, a side effect, a machine of war forged in thousands of battles. Ah, oh, Christ, a philosopher. But perhaps more importantly, people like Hansen do not make millions if they are easy to read. He is a man of layers interweaving. Nova, that was very good. We have arrived. The hounds then. In possession. Ready for the next phase. Talk soon. You are good. Come on through. Did you hear? Some Euro trash are coming to see Kurt. Let's go. Park. Before we go in, remember, he wants something from us, not the other way around. We are here to sell him Sinosure mainframe access codes. Stick to the facts. Know who you are and are not. Hansen awaits us! <laughs> Let us go see him. Magnifique, because we have a meeting with Colonel Hansen, now. Moment, please. Good, you made it. 
We haven't met yet. Name's Murphy. The colonel is here already. He is. Waiting for you. Fantastic. This way. Murphy. It seems familiar. No, I believe we have met. I'm certain we haven't. Oh, oui, oui. You love to frequent the bordellos of Paris, no? Uh, 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 what? <laughs> I'm only fucking with you, Murphy. It's a pleasure. Here we are. Our stop. You should expect to have eyes on you all day today. Kurt got a tip. The FIA plans to pull some gonk move. Huh. Is that so? The situation's under control, though. He ordered everyone checked out. No exceptions. Got our people manning the whole stadium. Drone-aided scans providing surveillance support, too. Need you to leave your weapons here. Next, we'll need to run some ID scans. Joke around as we might, get along as we do. Ultimately, this is a place of serious business. You understand? This here's the heart of our little empire. Tell me, what do you do here? Your operation, precisely. Arms trading, mostly. Need to start a war? End one? Planning a coup, maybe. We don't ask these questions. And this hall is from Night City? Some. But our reach stretches around the globe. Japan, Australia, the Balkans, Lagos. You name it. Yeah. All right, I'm in position. Prepare an IEVAC route now. Take your time. I need ten more minutes at least. Not much further now. I couldn't get started earlier without risk of being compromised. And Emmerich, they should go without saying, but stay in character. Good luck. Ah, Let's keep my moving. Brother. He talks little. Huh. Noticed and noted. Sometimes I find this creepy. But not you, I hope. Hey, just met the guy. My my. A diplomat. Pleasure to see you both. Songbird needs a moment to disarm the device. Which gives us a chance to chat. We are not in a hurry. <laughs> I'm sure. I hear you're not the type to do anything hastily. I do not waste time and energy on insignificant matters. So I heard. Is that why you strip yourself of your memories and store them in external data banks? In my quest for mental hygiene. For spiritual economy. Do you believe in God, Colonel Hansen? Mm, which one? The Euro dollar? The geopolitical powers that be? Or the Christian God? No. Wastes of my time all. 
I see. Then I am curious how you will fare after this life has ended. Changing the subject, did you enjoy yourselves at the Black Sapphire? My people tell me the games went high stakes. You two left richer and happier, I hope. By the end of the night, we lost our entire stack. But such is gambling. Oh, judging by your tone, that doesn't seem to bother you at all. Because it does not. I enjoy money, of course. But I do not allow it to control my life. You know what they say about great minds. I think it's no surprise we find ourselves doing business together. The Black Sapphire is my pride and joy. I worked hard to make it the go-to destination for Night City's royalty. Why did you stay in Night City? You are not from here. Well, seems I'm not the only one who's done their homework. It's a good question. One I've asked myself many times. Call it a symbol I've grown attached to. Like the NUS flag, Night City represents a great failure. Of yours? Of principles. Say, it's been a while since you were last in Night City, hasn't it? Not since Sinoshore. Quite right, but we almost flew here some time ago. Emmerich had other business in Night City. My brother is obsessed with cars. <laughs> he collects them. I say to him how wonderfully pretentious he is. Interesting. And what rare gem brought you halfway around the world? Emmerich! Perhaps you know this man, uh, Grayson? He wanted to sell me a classic Porsche, once owned by a famous American rocker boy. Everyone knows Grayson, and this rock star. Yeah, I remember hearing about this sale. Well, it fell apart. Grayson was a fool. He weaseled out in the final hour. Please, I have vodka. Help yourselves. I'm sure you never put pleasure before business, but I insist. A symbolic drink. <laughs> I could not say it better myself. Symbolic, yes. Not very American, I know, but it's a custom my friends in Siberia taught me to love. You have many friends, it seems. Oh, I've visited many places, forged my fair share of stories to be sure. Siberia was just one pit stop of many. Oh, you are a well-traveled man. It's easier to count the places I haven't been. I know where to find what no one else has, and who to call to get it. There are two ways to build a strong professional network. One is travel, the other a prison term. Ah, right. I'd almost forgotten. My friends in La Sante send their regards. C-Block. Uh, your friends are mistaken, I think. Are you sure? You spent two years in that prison, under a false name. That's right. In the VIP wing. But the cockroaches in C-Block don't know who is there. Then forgive me. I must be mistaken. Colonel. May I see your knife? By all means. It's a traditional Yakut hunting knife. You see, I spent some time in the Philippines. I've had a keen eye for fine blades since. Fascinating. Such a rare thing. By the way, Amrick, I asked around a bit doing my due diligence. They tell me you worked at Petrochem three years ago. Corporations rarely let your caliber talent slip through their fingers. How did you wriggle out of the contract? Is something wrong? Colonel, this may be difficult to believe, but I do not remember. Hmm? I store my memories in external databanks. 
My data banks from that time were stolen. Forgive me, I would like to answer, but I cannot. Please, it's no problem. Ah, so me. We can begin. The mainframe is ready. You remember the terms. One of you feeds in the access codes, the other stays with me. Ooh, I volunteer to stay. To work, then. Follow me. As agreed, you'll see the payments hit your account today. Huh? While you are waiting, I ran some initial diagnostics. The mainframe is prepped and linked with our systems. She's ready to go. You know, he created this lab especially for the occasion. Tens of millions of eddies invested for your visit alone. That's Kurt for you. I have a plan in place for once we secure the neural matrix. I'll hack the local net, override its defense systems, turn the whole stadium hostile. We'll slip out in the chaos. But... how many would die? They'll die so we can survive. Live. I managed to simulate the mainframe's native environment. The bunker. It'll be ready for the access codes in a moment. Listen, V. All hell breaks loose in two minutes. When Hanson flatlines, we haul ass. I'll block access to this room. Alex and Reed are minimizing risk and exfilling early via the route. Here she is. In all her glory. Oh, and don't worry about us. Got that sorted already. Check stadium blueprints. No which way to run. So, shall we? I am ready. Linked. Connection quality. Thousandth of the decimal. It'll have to do. Then in we go. Actuating the mainframe. So I see. It's responding. Stay sharp. Almost open for input. Hey, thank you. Really. Thank you for being here. Just... a little... more... Okay, your turn. It's ready for the access codes. Lincoln now. Relax, Sony. We're almost there. Hmm. Home stretch. Mm hmm. Kurt, we have a problem. No, I can handle the one down here. Really expected this to work? So me! Wait! Ah, you... You don't know what you're doing! Oh, but I do know me. Doing what I have to to survive. Trust Reed when he says he can help you. And honestly, nothing. You should you too. Nothing. Two faces. Ah! Ah! 
to me. You'll pay for what you did. Just want you dead. You don't expect me to roll over, I hope. Though I must say, I'm disappointed. If Myers ever wants me to take her.
Big fucking mistake, prick! Dogtown Alpha Hound. My ass. Sit rep. 
Alex is dead. Songbird is flown. It could be, it could still be her in there, or, or what? Some kind of rabbit AI? Fuck. Reed will find her. Cybercycle on that scale won't go unnoticed in the city. You're right. Finding her is priority one. Where, where, where could be anywhere? Best check NCPD scanner for chatter. Yes, Omi's been spotted down north. Omega class target. Will. I repeat, Omega class target. Max Tech is inbound. All units, all units. Max Tech is on the scene. Stand down. I repeat, stand down. Look, AVs. Max Tech. NC Police. In Dogtown? Everybody's willing to make an exception for Max Tech when you got a cyber psycho on your doorstep. They're looking for so me. We're following him. Max Tech? Don't tell me you mean to fight him. No, but we need to know what's going on. Target is Omega Class. I repeat, Omega Class target at large. Max Tech is en route. That's yes, her. She's completely lost. Max Tech in God. position, eyes on target. Same good. Hold your fire. Target exhibiting strange behavior. She's on the ground. Appears to be unconscious. Target secured. There's one thing left for us to do. Madam President, I have news. Tell me. We're burned. For now, at least. Songbird is in NC police custody. I have no sway with the city government. This is your problem to fix, Reed. Understood. I'll get her to land me. And remember, I want her alive. So, what do we do now? We get to work. Get on the hollow. I'll do the same. We make calls to whoever comes to mind. Find us a netrunner you trust, one who's capable of getting inside NCPD systems. Reed, we'll get her back. I know. And say, my turn. I got a job for you this time. You for me. Peculiar. Next Max Tech prisoner transport to Los Padres. Need to know the convoy's route. Max Tech. Prisoner. Los Padres. Interesting. Stakes too high for comfort. Can always find help elsewhere. Did I say they were? I have a contact. One capable of extracting the information you require. For the right price. 15,000. Non-negotiable. Still interested? Sipping the ads your way now. And I expect results is... Transfer received. I'm sending the coordinates. Be there in... There with me? Ten hours. The data shard will be waiting. Encrypted, naturally. Accessible to you based on biometric identification. Oh, and do your utmost not to make a mess of this V. I despise cleaning up after others. Thanks. Later, hands. Hello, welcome. Hand silly, I'd swing by. It's about a gig. Oh, it's you. Before we continue, I need to verify through biometric scan. Connect here. Fine, have it your way. It will only take a moment. It won't hurt a bit. 
What they all say. They also say the proof is in the data. You cannot know who anyone truly is until you see what lies within. Small things that help Annette run her sleep at the night. There. Authorization confirmed. All you need is here. Just so you know, gathering it wasn't easy. The Max Tac Data Fortress is a labyrinth and a panopticon combined. Every node you pass attracts a thousand unwanted stairs. But you managed. <laughs> You're my hero, Yoko. Wait. Our cooperation need not end here, if you catch my meaning. That is, if you plan to do what I think with this data. Interested? Maybe. Now, strict hypothetical. What you think I aim to do? Let's suppose you positioned yourself where a certain convoy was to pass. Mm-hmm. And? And let's suppose you are either prepared or insane enough to eliminate the guards of the convoy. Hot or cold? Getting warm. Our mutual friend would offer additional thanks for the windfall that would result from this. If you would be so kind and send us the coordinates of the location where you deal with your problem. You after your max tech gear, is that it? Get there before anyone else does? Mm, you would only need to send the coordinates. Give it a shot, but no promises. I need the coordinates, nothing more. In return, I guarantee a generous reward. Good luck. I know that data is causing us to max tech to max murder. They'll have to get in line. Touche. All right, let's get Reed's super spy people on this. See where it leads. Psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tap hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Ready to plan, strategize? Got everything we need? Got everything we can count on having. I flick through your intel. Convoy routes, vehicle array, weaponry they're likely to have. It's not gonna be easy. The reason they're called Psycho Squad's twofold. They're almost cyber-psychos themselves. 
The best chance we have of stopping them is here. Traffic minimal, vantage points optimal. They'll come down this road. Once in range, we hit them hard. Bring them to a stop. We then neutralize all MaxTac operatives, grab Songbird, run it to an exfil point just across the SoCal border. Our friend here knows the specifics. He'll fill you in. I got one last thing I need to take care of. All right, let's hear what you've cooked up. Hmm. Here's a lowdown. Convoy will roll in from the northwest. Likely run right into the booby trap cars will set up. This could decommission a few vehicles. Force the rest to switch lanes. We'll cut off any chance of retreat. Set off some planted charges. Stop them dead in their tracks. Second read pops a behemoth driver. You'll dive in. Your chum read also requested some badass toys. Offensive turrets, mines, smoke grenades, Ladder, not an issue, but the mines and turrets. Want a way in, sift to the deets, or leave prep to me. It's your call. Deets, my man, walk me through them. Right on. When fixing to go out, guns blazing, best be on your own terms. Slot the shard. Once a drone's airborne, I'll explain the what's, how's, and why's. Let's give it a whirl. Two items of biz to nail down. One's your strategy. Second, the kit we need to set you up Gear. with. Gear, what's on the tasty menu? Sitch is simple. Reed wants both mines and turrets. Well, I want a divorce without saying goodbye to a single any. Can't have a cake, but only to stare at it till it goes bad. Short notice, folks. Can hook you up with one or the other, not both. Turrets for firepower, mines for crippling mobility. Your call, boss. Turrets, where would you put them? Way I see it, got two possibilities. Could line them up along one side. Pile on the pressure, draw attention. Good suppressing fire, too. But they're psychos, not gongs. They'll wisen up and go around them eventually. Option two, place the turrets around the site. Max Bastard will get nailed in the crossfire. It's sure to slow him down. Your choice. Suppressing fire from one side, or lead pounding from different angles to slow him down. Let's set him up around the ambush site. You got it. Wanna talk strategy? What are our options? Got about as many as there are freely tea rooms in Dogtown. So, not a whole lot. Do best to figure out the position you'll be ambushing them from. Then decide if smoke nades favor you there. How would we use them? We set nades off on the road. For a time, the assholes will be aiming and shooting blind. Hopefully, each other. What about reading me? Want to reduce visibility for us? Newsflash. There's no such thing as perfect solutions. Always some trade-off. We can paralyze them. Ease your way into their ranks but it'll cost you the reduced effectiveness of Reed's covering fire. Decision's yours. We doing nades or not? What the hell? Let's try using them. Should be surprising. Even if they're quick to regroup, it'll buy us time. A gamble. But it could pay off. Like my old man used to say, life's a losing game. But you go all in anyway. Moving on. Your start positions for when the shit hits the fan. Care for a gander? Nah. No, all I need to know. Thanks. Plan's shaping up real nice. Just need a word with Reed now. Hmm. Gonna set up then. And make tracks. As for you two, well, good fucking luck. Ready on my end, you? Almost.
This is our jammer. I just need to calibrate it so the signal isn't too strong. Otherwise, so me could... I just hope we're not too late. Clear to see. You care about her still. Reed? Let's focus on the task at hand. Fine, say fuck all for all I care. I'm focused on the up. That's it. Focused, right. That's what it is. V. Spare both of us the bullshit. You want to know the truth? Fine. Today, or seven years ago, don't know what exact point I fucked up. The end result's that now we're here while she, she could die. I just pray that she's... She's the one we're saving. The soul me I knew. And not some... I'm fucking scared, V. Scared my grip on everything is slipping. There. Happy? Maybe you're right, maybe you're not. Won't know till we finish this. So let's hop to it. I just gotta jam max tax frequencies. Get ready. That thing jamming his pangs of conscience too? Ought to get myself one. What do you want about now? Chick's a half brain dead, half AI controlled zombie. Yet still the gonk's convinced his old partner's trapped inside. That only he can save her. What would the Big J do? Abandon hope? Know what being in the army taught me? Hope dies last, cause the backstabbing bitch makes damn sure she gets you killed first. So you'll warm the fucking grave for her. Saw many thousand yard stairs. Willpower gone, hope hovering for no reason. Wanna bet on miracles? Go ahead. I'll pass. Just talk to her. Huh? Body language. I could tell you enabled the relic. So was it her? Did you grab hold of Song? Uh, nah. Still no contact with Somi. In radio silence since all that shit went down at the stadium. Right. Understood. All right. Jam is calibrated. Do you know what to do? Take my position, await the convoy. Going hot when I see the charges pop. We grab Song and head for the expo point on the border. Clean quick, no slip-ups, no trip-ups. And one eye on Song the whole time, got it? Okay, moving to my position. Good luck, Reed. We won't need luck. Okay, waiting. I got eyes on the target. All right, they're entering the tunnel. V. Songbird? How the hell did you... I was... Not you. Anyone but you. So me, you there? Link's alive? I trusted you, but I won't, won't mistake again. Stay out of my way. I, I'm warning you. It'll be over soon. 
We're close by. Here to help. You wouldn't read. Help. You would break me out of this cage just to shove me in another. Soon I'll regain control. You wanna move, get ready. Songbird made contact. Link's still active. She won't forgive us, not for- Don't expect her to. You need to focus now. On my mark. Give him hell. I'm at the truck, Reed. Careful now. Fuck! Who the fuck are you? Ah, 
Talking. Read. Shit. I'll be all right, V. Got the luck of the damned me. Need any help? I'll manage. Shit was a moment there. I thought we were gunners. Nah, you and me, we bid him bye-bye. Go. Stay in the tail. We can't lose her. I'll catch up as soon as I patch myself up. You sure? Go. Save her, V. I'll keep this line open. The group of you as soon as I can. Copy that. Who taught you how to fucking drive? Shroom, you fucking serious? Max had pushed me into you. I wasn't moving, I was stationary. Looking at a wall with a huge hole in it. Truck rammed clean through. You have eyes on her? Is she okay? No visual yet. Need to scope the place out. Stay sharp. Overloaded. Short cert just before I got here. It's her. She can't have gone far. She lost control completely? Thoughts? Hello. Do not know. Follow her. Stay on her. I'll make my way towards her. Bring her out alive, V. If I'm to help her, if I'm to help you, I need her alive. into the abyss, you'll find the abyss staring right back at you. And I don't like the look it's given me. The kind that says there ain't no coming back. Sure you want to do this? Don't got a choice, not really. Always got a choice, V. Like the choice to Delta the fuck out of here for one. Come too far, Johnny. Remember what's at stake. We don't get the song, we don't get the help Reed promised us. Oh, I remember. Question is if whatever's down there is still the songbird we know and love. Find out soon enough. logo. Can't be right, can it? Find the terminal. Jack in. I think I might know what this place is. Patching you in. Top secret military facility dating back from the pre data crash days. Sinoshore. The data's decrypting. Hold on. 
Sinusure. Cyberspace equivalent of a nuke. Militex answered Arasaka's soul killer. Just the next edition of your average megacorp mega dick contest. Somi mentioned this facility once. Militech net runners taking a plunge into the so-called deep net. Yeah. She said something to the Black Sapphire mentioned big game hunting for rogue AIs. They try to bait them back to the Black Wall, trap them and tame them. So then Song. She's not running from us, V. She wants a permit to the Black Wall. She is good to be Ah, shit! You still don't understand the thing, do you? You never will. Not fully. Not me. How it feels to lose yourself. Layer after layer. Th that's why you betray. Betray. Stop me. running and let us help. You. You still trust Reed? It's more. convenient. Yes. They lie to you. You're sinking. Grasping at straws as the deluge consumes you. Saul Myers. You promised to help me too. It. It doesn't matter now. We still want the same thing. And if anyone can help us, it's Reed. Reed lives in a world of half truths of his own making. Fuck! Come on, Songbird! Songbird? Or she woke something up down there that did that for her. And here we are going down, 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 the rabbit hole into the heart of darkness. Tell me you've got a plan. Gotta get to so many for the Black Wolf does. Save her. Real noble of you, long as the Black Wall hasn't stripped her to the bone. Cause then we'd be walking straight into a trap. V, what's up? What is it? She's... she's here. Chick's establishing a link with the relic, but... She's not alone. Is it the Black Wall? Wall? Johnny. Johnny!
fired a fucking missile at us. Innocent people, dead. A miracle Myron even survived. Wasn't the deal. Not even close. Songbird? Chalk it up to historical necessity. Your plan lacked grit. Mine produced results. You used me. <laughs> Give me a break. What the... You're backed into a corner. Nowhere to run. And until I get what I want, in that corner you'll stay. The data from the Sinashore mainframe. Bring me that. Then, and only then. You'll let me go. <laughs> Songbird, you okay? That... vision... the hell was that? I mean, what the fuck? Vision... Oh my god! Memory... is madness! Come on, Songbird! I trust it! The one who did... betrayed me... is my one witness! True, huh? Guess I'll just have to jack you out of these systems.
Lockdown protocol to service corridors. Lockdown protocol in effect. Remote control operated by data terminal Bravo. Just a Tech's protected from physical damage. Not likely to even scratch it. <sighs> Gotta be another way. Huh. Under there, maybe. <sighs> no, Songbird. This ends now. Time you wake up, it'll be over and done with. Shit, feel it. Easy answers here. Did you ask the wrong questions? <laughs> 
strain of control. Canceling remaining lockdown procedures. Entry sector lockdown disabled. Movement between sectors open. Okay, that's finally clear. Coming for you, so me. Solemnly swear to faithfully serve the new United States of America. So help me God. Ugh. So help me God. What now? Learn, be useful, resourceful. Reed will see to that. And whatever you need, it'll be provided. Welcome to the FIA. Oath, credentials, coin. What have you gotten me into? Nothing you'll regret. Besides, I'll be right beside you. Always. I promise. Two questions. Shoot. You regret it? You regret it? You regret it? Like ever? 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 Once. 
a long while back. Decided then and there, I never regret it again. Uh huh. Uh huh. Second question. Ever broken a promise? Once. A long while back. Haven't broken one since. Never will. Careful. Careful. I'll hold you to that. Initiated lockdown. Gotta find another way. Scrap metal again. 
Shield, which he has the wrong weapons. Is that why he ultimately leaves all that he can on? In there, girl. They're gonna get through this. Who the fuck are you? We have left you no options. So me, 
That you? Some days, I'd open the window, sit on the sill, and just listen to the straight sounds. You know, life happening. It was somehow soothing that. Now, I can't hear, I can't feel anything. Can you? So me, this is all a kind of projection, like the others. Others? Saw you with Reed, Myers. Saw your past. Don't remember? No. The black wall consumes me all. The emptiness grows. I feel it. Fill it with memories. They keep taking them away. So me. In the lab a second ago. That machine almost... I thought... Did you save me? There's a me saving your life. Another me talking to you. Time and space are relative here. Here meaning where? My unit in Brooklyn. Told you about it. Remember? So me. We're still in the bunker. This place. It's not real. I made so many mistakes. Did terrible things. But here, back then, they never mattered. I gave myself one last chance, and you stripped me of it. Why? You lied, so me. Stabbed everyone in the back. I had to. I never wanted to join them, V. I... You saw... what I became because of them. You saw what I lost. I know what I've done. Know the price I've paid. What you don't know is how sorry I am. How much it all hurts. So me. So me. Ambitious, disappointing. No, mostly just here. It's open. The fuck, so me? Been calling you three straight days. Don't worry, got everything under control. Are you fucking kidding me? Passed out in your goddamn chair last week. I spent the night making sure you didn't overheat and die. Yeah, well, no one asked you to. Oh, you even hear yourself? 
Listen, got this new gig, like earth shaking. If it works out, I'll be the first. Be making history. Now I just need to focus. I need time, space to think. There it is, your new mantra. But where does it leave us? Know what? Fuck this. I'm done. I... I lost. Didn't I? Everything I did... The people I hurt... It's meaningless. It matters not at all. Yeah, you lost so me. Just can't tell how or when it all went so wrong. I... I don't know either. You lied. Stabbed everyone close to you in the back. Close to me? About time you faced the truth, so me. About time. You gotta be shitting me. I'm not going anywhere with you. Making me leave my home, my friends, everything worth a damn to me? What's ahead is important. Worth so much more. Yeah, no. Hard pass. Dick, Netwatch rolls up here. What happens to your people? Who trust you? Who care about you? Netwatch will know. Who lent you the eddies for your deck? Who let you tap into the subnet of the cafe downstairs? Understand that. I'm the one chance of keeping you safe. Your friends say. Or sure. Let them get hurt. Blackmail? That your play? Don't know me enough. But I do know your type. And I know your answer. Just haven't admitted it to yourself yet. I thought if I could control the future, I'd feel safe always. But I should have looked to the past. To lessons about loss. Repeated. Repeated. Mistakes be too many to count. We all make mistakes. Shit. No, I've made my fair share. Some mistakes are irreparable. So what? Means you gotta quit? Stop fighting for yourself? You can't change the past, so me. But some memories you turn your back and walk away. It's true we die this way. Our memories to comfort us? Not gonna let you die, Somi. We'll make it out of here. Together. Thank you. I'll keep this moment as this memory. Just one. Back home. A friend at my side. Before it all goes dark. For one last second. I'll know I wasn't alone. What's happening? The black wall. We have just seconds. What? So me, where? The core. Look for me there and help me. One last time. Copy, Reed. V, finally. Blackwell's locked down. It's your location now. She's here. She's alive. Good. Take care of her. I'll be there shortly. We'll save her yet. So me.
be. It's good you're here. Second chance. <laughs> I never really got it, did I? Ain't over yet. Just hold out a little longer. You know, that's not true. I see it on your face. So me. I'm... I'm fading, V. Help me out. So me. I... I tried on my own. Don't have to strike. Please. End it. I'll go quickly. So me. I... It'll be over. I can't. That's not a solution. It's the only solution. I'm begging you, V. Song, think about it. Even if the FIA fails, you'll find another way. Don't give up, not like this. V, you don't understand. Lost everything too once. Hit bottom. Bounce back. Still fighting. Fighting till I win. No, V. Not the same. Please. I need to die. It's the only way. Can't. Can't live in this hell. No. Won't kill you, so me. Just can't accept an end like that. No, please. You're leaving me to a fate worse than, than death. Show me. You're all right. It'll be over soon. You'll get some rest. Help me. said a word the whole way. What's eating you? Dunno. I don't know, V. Can't beat yourself to death over this reed. What matters is she's alive. We're alive. We did good. Did the right thing. We'll get her help. But I can't. I can't help stop seeing the same scene. Like it's burned inside my dome. We're in a car, moving. Leaving Brooklyn. She refuses to turn, look back. No tears, no sobbing, just a statement. Seems like you saved my life. She doesn't believe it. I can hear she doesn't believe it. Would she say the same now? You did. Think you saved her then. Hope we'll save her again now. We're in the same boat. Clock's ticking for both Song and me. 
Just hope the FIA's up to the task. Of course. Let's go. Out of the car. Now. Stand the fuck down. Can't you see she needs help? V, I need you to help her. I got it. Right here, sir. Easy does it. Area secured. All clear for landing. Don't worry, Somi. We'll help. This will be over soon. Take good care of her. V, the President would like a word. Can't loiter here. Good to see you, Madam President. Likewise. Congratulations. I see the operation was a success. V, you risked your life to help me. To help our nation. That merits recognition. Didn't do all this for a medal. Because I had no choice. I'm trying to survive, not collect scrap. I see. Very well, then. In spite of everything, I appreciate your help. It won't be forgotten. You can help her. You're sure? Rest easy. She'll be in excellent hands. Receive the best care available on the continent. She'd better, Rosalind. She'd better. Both of you saved So Me's life, Fee. You can't put a price on that, but I'll try. What about the help you promised me? The medal is purely symbolic, of course. Your actual compensation will be more practical. Reed will fill you in on the details. So long, Rosalind. Best of luck, V. Perhaps one day you'll be called on to serve again. We'll have our eye on you. You all right? We're all set to go. She asked me once if I, if I'd always be by her side when she fucked up. I said I wouldn't miss it for the world. She didn't believe me. Just smiled. She shook her head. She wasn't buying it. I could tell. Then she dropped this bomb.
Lost all my friends when you recruited me, she says. Now don't you become my enemy. That's all I ask. I wonder now if she was right not to believe me. Or did I keep my promise? fucking hot. The medal they tried to offer you, Zomi got the same one. Right after her first FIA off. She gave it to a homeless man on 21st. The guy just pinned it to his jacket like it was nothing. And asked for spare change. Damn it, V. Just damn. So me safe. Need to start looking out for yourself now. Meaning what exactly? You know what? Meaning not getting sidelined, benched. Thought you could take another seven years of that. You're right. I couldn't. Listen, I need a few days to put together what we promised you. I trust that's no problem. Sure. I can wait. A few days won't kill me. Since the start of this whole FIA business, been trying to pin down a strange feeling. This fear gnawing at my insides, yelling louder and louder, yelling that I should delta as far away as possible. Think I finally figured out what it was. So, Johnny, of you, ghost in the second shit gets complicated. Or uncomfortable. Fuck off. How's that for being Johnny? Just look at your relationships. Okay. Enough. Some stories don't get a happy ending for the credits roll. Leaving questions you're never gonna find the answers to. Questions you'll lug around till the day you croak. <sighs> Sounds about right. Better believe it. Story's over, Johnny. You're beating a dead horse. What if it's not actually dead? Past's the past. Do yourself a favor and let it rest in peace. Now, uh, one way or another, shit always ends up fucked. First Saburo, then Yorinobu, now Myers. Got a knack for getting in dangerous peeps' ways, you know? For real, though. How's it feel, you know, with all that's gone down? So me didn't have to die back there. Did what I thought was right. Right for you? For her? For me? Song will get better. It'll work out for the best in the end. Oh, what? How's that? Shit so hollow could swear I heard an echo.
Not helping, Johnny. Not making your life any easier, I know. But thinking about Songbird, about Reed, finally starting to see why I did all the shit I did. Why I went AWOL during the war, then set off on the warpath against Arasaka. Why I called Carrie a fucking pussy so many times. I think I finally understand why, despite all that's gone down, I feel for Reed. Cause we're one and the same. Idealists fighting for a cause, blind to the fact that it'll put everyone we care about in the ground. Only thing sets us apart is his faith in the system, in its principles. Except the line between believing in an ideal and being plain naive is, well, pretty fucking thin. No, no comparison, Johnny. Reed was making up for his past, correcting his mistakes. Fought for a second chance, for himself and Song. You? Guess I was never chasing ideals, not really. Life. That's what I was running from. And? Still running? Does it matter? I'm still breathing. Sort of. Just don't know what the fuck for. Gotta keep reminding yourself. I'll start by taking a good look at myself in the mirror. Already know I'm gonna fucking hate what I see. Alright. Good talk. Get up. <laughs> Those thoughts, feelings... Didn't expect that from you, Johnny. Probably because you think you've got me all figured out. No, just, uh, didn't realize that under that prick rocker boy exterior, you're nothing but a big old softy. Yeah, fuck you too. This is 
coming my way? Far better. I see a blank page in Night City's Chronicle. Hang on, gotta go. As you were saying. Far better. I see a blank page in Night City's Chronicle. Your name is on it. The page and up. Gotta go. Don't want to wait in vain. Here's open. Don't got time for hey. Out. Now. Grab a seat. First met here. Same exact court. Different ball game. Can't deny that. I called you because I never got a chance to thank you. We did what we had to. So me a live. Good work. So what about so me? How's she doing? The changes in her nervous system. Entropic breakdown. They were too far gone. The Matrix didn't take. It's now in storage, being kept for you. We had to resolve to alternate means, but Somi will live. I believe she might even return to active duty. Gotta hope these alternate means of yours do the trick. We made her a promise. Told her she'd be okay. I said she'd get the best care available. A chance to make up for her mistakes, mend her ways. I can't do any more than that. Yeah, I know, you're right. Did what we had to. Only thing we could do to give Somi a second chance. Somehow keep her safe. I'm with you on that. Just can't help wondering if... He couldn't have done more for her. V, Songbird is an FIA agent in critical condition in an FIA clinic. In the care of our top specialists. There's nothing more I can do for her. It's fully out of my hands. You in some kind of trouble? Myers has summoned me back to Washington. Langley or Glencoe's probably my next post. Desk job. To start, for a while. Plucking promising operatives out of a pool of new recruits. Man, you hate this gig. But your head's so far up Washington's ass that you don't see it. <laughs> what else is wrong with me? Stockholm Syndrome? Nah, don't need to be any sort of specialist to see you're in deep, deep denial. Rosalind used you seven years ago. Used you again now. Gonna sit in your hands till she plucks you out of the freezer again? That's the job. Fuck, Reed. Should go corporate. Not really any safer, but the pay sure shit better. At least you'd have a career to show for it. Mm-hmm. All right. Take care, Reed. I'll drop you a signal once our neurosurgeons are set. Take care, V. I'm gonna hang back a little. Our neurosurgeons have devised the right neural matrix command. You ready to keep that construct to the curb? Okay. Yeah. I'm ready. An FIA AV can pick you up stat. I just need a meeting point. Preferably secluded. Place called Misty's Esoterica. Roof of the building. Right. We'll be standing by. You don't want to do... Say you told the FIA to stick their offer where the sun don't shine. Just don't make the call to read. We'll find another way. Do what now? Message. Didn't see it? They want to wipe me. 
Need me to explain the ins and outs? Come on, you knew I'd fight for my life to the end, no matter the price. It's obvious to you as it was to me. Called me a chump, but I never thought I'd be that price. Come on, V. Don't make the call. Something that might work versus a surgical procedure. Choice is clear, Johnny. Raising Reed on the hollow. Meeting point. You there? Bet I am. Actually eager to be clinic bound. AV's on his way. It won't be long now. Good luck, V. Thanks, Reed. For everything. So this is how it ends. Gonna argue about this again? Can we please not? Got my pride, V. Not about to beg for my life. James Weiss, FIA. I guess you're V, is that right? If I may? It's an honor to meet the man who rescued the president of the NUSA. Right. Thanks. Where's Reed? Didn't make the trip with you? He got held up. On assignment. Not to worry. You're in good hands. Come on inside. Doc Lozano will evaluate your condition, make sure you're stable. Good hands. Gonna hold you to that. Lozano, pleasure. I'll be among those operating on you. Let's start with a quick nervous system scan. You mind giving me your personal link? So, how's it looking, Doc? <laughs> hmm. I'd say the prognosis is good. Neural network degradation looks reversible. In another new lease on life. Mind opening the door? Wanna enjoy the view. Don't worry, you'll be back here in no time. Can never be too sure. Just open it. You shook my hand, Weiss. Indulge me? Human meat grinders. Survived it once. 
do well to remember that. If you ever tossed back in again. I'm sure I'll handle it. Slipped up occasionally, but learned a buttload over the last few weeks. Interesting. Cause I see someone who's come all this way without learning shit. Congrats. Can feel proud of what you've become. What the hell you want from me, Johnny? Acknowledgement, decency, a sprinkling of regret, and an apology. Want an apology for me choosing to save my own life? No, V. An apology for fucking ending mine. You spent your whole life living on a whim, looking out for your ass and your ass alone. You got no right to lecture me, silver hand. You want me to act like this? Us was just a big nothing burger, and we'll just drift off into sweet slumber. Except only one of us is waking up. You deserve it. Going out like this. How the fuck so? Enlighten me. For starters, you're a narcissist and a sociopath. Only way you can live with yourself is by believing you never do anything wrong. Pinning the blame for your mistakes on others. Know the worst part, though? Nah, but guessing you do. Actually, could have been the fuck the system, gung ho rebel king you so like to think you were. But you self destructed. See, I didn't kill you, nor did Arasaka. Your sheer fucking arrogance did, Johnny. Always were your worst enemy. You. Your hubris. I've got readings spiking. Strong emotions. Let's do this. We want your brain burden free. Never know how stress might affect it. You done? About sums it up. Yeah. Said my piece. Made mistakes. I admit it. We all do. But if you think I wanted to be a hero, then you don't know jack shit about me. Sleep? Yeah, no matter. Time you got up. V, you in there? Yeah, about time, Holmes. It'll be all right, V. You'll see. It's important to have people you can turn to. You know, like, uh, family. Take care, V. Then you'll find your own down in Night City. Sweet dreams, then. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. Afterlife. See you there. Eyes, they're opening. I think he sees me now. V, can you hear me? Think I... in here. And I can talk. Good. About time. Was told... 
You got a new job. New duties. Lots of them. Busy bear. No time for me. Who said that? When? Wise. In the AV. You weren't there. Right, right. Well, I'm not as busy anymore. Besides, I plain wanted to see you. And the doc said you needed to see a familiar face. Now, in particular. So, yeah. Pretty nice welcome. Just missing flowers and a get well card. Given I'm here, guess things worked out all right, huh? Never that simple. Doc saved you. You're alive. Here in a big ass butt in there. Because there is one. Deep invasive work on your nervous system. To cut the Angram out safely. What's that even mean? Your neurons can no longer handle most implants. Chrome. Your brain can manage your personal link and simple code processors. But any use of a combat implant well, it could kill you. I'm sorry, V. But the life you used to know is gone. There's uh, one other thing. You were out for two years. It's 2079. You're shitting me. Believe me. I wish I could have said it was all good. Seventy fucking nine? You take me for a ride. This some sick joke? <laughs> For we say it is. We just admit. I don't know. Just the, you don't know. You, you aren't sure. Whatever. I wish I could help you, V. But I can't. Need some air. Oh, legs are jelly. Can barely stand. Been laid up for two years, V. Need to get out of here. And see, when can I go back? Today, if that's your wish. But you should ask yourself... Green, where's my stuff? Be listen to me. Your body, it ain't going back to what it was. And Nancy's a city where you just won't manage. Not anymore. Please understand. I'd like to spare you that disappointment at least. Great. And what comes next? We truly appreciate what you did for us. We can set you up with a job here at Langley. No. Offers like that. Not ready for him yet. Understood. I still wanted you to know right off that you had the option. Look. My world just shattered. Like... Into splinters. Really think I can plan my next career move? Besides... This isn't my life, Reed. But it could be. Given your old one is long gone. Don't know, someday maybe. Need to think. But now, going home to NC, definitely. Didn't escape death just to waste away here. <sighs> Up to you. Once you know where you're headed, call the nurse. And if you change your mind, you know where to find me.
Read. Thank you. No need, V. You've got no reason to thank me. Vic. V? Is it really you? The one and only. <sighs> Unbelievable. But how are you... Uh, why? See, met a net running genius. Made friends. And gave her up to the NUSA. Traded her for surgery using their tech. Well, I won't judge. You had your reasons, I'm sure. <sighs> What's the matter? Karma got me good. Spent two years in a coma. Also, chrome's a no-go for me. Can't use it. Even simple muscle boosters. Is that what they told you? I just know it. Come see me, V. Be on my way to see you soon. Usual spot. Yeah. In a manner of speaking. I'll see you, V. You know the address. How can I help you? Night City. Can I get a flight there? Of course. An AV is ready and waiting. I'll come get you now. Back on your feet. It's nice to see that finally. Exactly the one I had in mind. Pick will love it. Sorry, uh, zoned out for a sec. That's quite all right. Night City can indeed overwhelm the occasional nuke. Might I ask how you feel? The gnome hasn't sunk in yet. Feels like just yesterday I was at home in these streets. Part of them. My deepest apologies. We've only met once before, hence my hasty conclusion that you're not a native. Indeed, Night City has since changed quite significantly. Man, been a while since I was last here. What else has changed? The most significant is Arasaka pulling the bulk of its operations out of Night City. I imagine you could be interested in hearing the latest news. I shall turn on the radio. And now, this week's scorching hot question, Yorinobu Arasaka, what happened? Joining us today, Masao Adams, author of Arasaka's biography, A Dragon Tamed. Glad to have you on the show. It's a pleasure to be here, Stan. An Arasaka spokesperson recently announced that Yorinobu has stepped yeah, down as CEO. Yeah, can turn it off now, thanks. As you wish. 
Arasaka's on the back foot, huh? It appears so. Other corporations have wasted no time in attempting to find Well, Johnny, you got your wish. Arasaka's on the way out. Except it's like playing Whack a Corp. Hit one, three others pop up. Uh, are you talking to me? No, to myself. Doesn't matter. This Better get going. Service. I shall await one last thing, if I may. We all eventually run out of fuel, but that hardly means the journey wasn't pleasant. Hey man, hold up. Ah, oh, come on. Do we gotta? You're not from around here, are you? Welcome to our Zeta Tech Network Clinic. How may I help you? Here to see Victor. Mind if I go through? Do you have an appointment? Yeah, private one. Ah, right. I see a note right here. Please hurry in. The next patient is due to arrive soon. Vic. <laughs> so good to see you, old Ripper. V. How long's it been? <laughs> Depends on your point of view. Ha! <laughs> You're making a habit of this. Rising from the dead. I actually thought I'd never see you again. Got it wrong, luckily. I love that I was wrong about this one. Want a drink to that? I'm serving. They have this rule, no drinking anywhere in the clinic. I could get reprimanded. Ooh. But well, hang on a minute. Oh, same one Jack and I knocked back. Championship bout for the middleweight title. Malone vs. Kano. Remember it as if it was yesterday. Life is simpler somehow. Wanted. Yeah, good times. Things changed. No denying it. Jackie's gone. So is Misty Shop. <laughs> and all her sense. <sighs> all right. Come on. Hop in the chair. Okay. Let's get to this. That's the attitude. 
So tell me, what's it like to be back among the living? I lost, Vic. Lost in life. All my plans, dreams. You survived. Can't function in my environment. So what's it matter? Me from two years back? Gone. Never gonna be him again. You know what I mean? What are you trying to say exactly? Sure hope you know what you're doing. Corp web? Pretty hard to escape once you're caught in it. Not to mention, you're a fucking home specialist. This chain came looking, knocking. Pressured me pretty hard. In a bid to survive, I gave them an indecently high price. They agreed to pay it. Asked Misty what she thought before you signed? Of course I did. What'd she say? Well, she said a lot of things. She is the sensitive sort. Changes unpleasant ones happening all around her. She stopped feeling good here. And no wonder. I miss her. Hope things work out for her. Hope they work out for all of us. <laughs> Funny. I was terrified I'd die for so long. I don't see what's funny about that. Point is, should have feared the passing of... of all the things I knew. <laughs> Can't imagine how Johnny felt, waking up after 50 years. You get old enough, you start coming to terms with things. Keeps you from drowning in your sentiments. Vic, <laughs> sensible as ever, and with achievable dreams. I never could settle on those. You'll learn. If you say so. Well, your core looks fine. Good even. Let's take a look at your motor cortex. Can't say I like that, hmm. First time I've seen anything like this. Your cortex seems to have turned deaf to implant signals. Maybe reinstall the neuroport firmware. No, no, that it. Maybe switch to binary signaling. That's a risk of shock. Life threatening. You said kind. you can do something, Vic. I... I was wrong. I'm sorry. Please don't worry, Vic. Didn't come with high hopes anyway. Not good. You have to believe there's something out there for you. Self-delusion? That's what you advise? No. I just want you to accept your reality. You've changed, yes, but you're alive. Look at me. I had to adapt, too. Still doing what I most love, though. I get it, Vic. I believe you. Stay calm, level. I think I even envy you. But that's just not me. Something was taken from me, and I can't accept it. Attitude like that can only bring pain. Might be how it has to be. Vector, come on quick. I ran into trouble. Need surgery. It's my... <clears throat> Ah, are you running late? I can't now, Tyler. Drop in tomorrow. Drop in tomorrow? This is my friend. No affiliation to the firm. Come back later, please. It's important to me. <clears throat> 
You got it wrong, man. You're on contract. Tyler, please. Vector, nothing personal, you know? But you sew me up now, or I'll file a complaint. Got a patient, Vic. Don't worry about me. Ugh. V. You can't know how sorry I am. Vector! Hey, swing by to see me anytime, yeah? Of course. Of course I'll drop by. Close the door on your way out, okay? I need to look to Tyler's pressing problem here. Guess you landed in some kind of shit store. Well, well. See that, Jimmy? He a corpo rat. Chill, man. Easy. Come on, hand over your scratch. Let's go. Drop it. Let me alone. Hmm. Uh. Nope. Show me the money. Got me. No denying it. Arasaka used to be. But I got the boot. Actually, we got shit in common, Shoons. Badges are my bane. Battened across the back, I nursed my bruises at El Coyote. El Coyote ain't round no more. Man, you a lazy dog. Not even bothering to weave a convincing story. now. Are you in one piece? I'm fine. <laughs> Mostly. Just a bit busted up is all. Those guys must have been real good to knock you down like that. Nah, Misty. Wasn't them. It was me. I'm no good. Not anymore. Oh, is that the relics doing? I know I should be worried, but honestly, I'm just so glad to see you. Missed you so much, Misty. <laughs> Though it feels like I saw you last Tuesday. Just two years, V. Blink of an eye for the universe. It must be hard for you, I know. But hardships pass, too. As all things. Probably got it right. Just darn hard to believe right this second. You saw what happened. Can't even stand up to a couple of random dipsos. Where do I go from here? You'll learn to live like us regular folk. Avoid dark alleys, run when you hear gunfire. Not much more to it. Huh. <laughs> that your bread and butter? Welcome to the world of the faces in the crowd, V. My ride will be here soon, but I still got a minute or two to talk. I really missed you, you know? So, you're finally leaving. Strange story, actually. You know what made me decide to leave? Me going off the grid? Pretty awkward, but I gotta say no. My favorable store burned down one day. Went there to buy some white sage and saw a charred mess instead. It was then I realized nothing's the same anymore. Jackie was gone. 
spewed up and ghosted. I decided to close the esoterica on the spot. I couldn't help other people find balance if I'd lost it myself. Nothing lasts forever. Gonna recover your peace of mind, Misty. Probably. Then I'll lose it again, recover it. But most likely, it'll always be different. A piece built on something new. Misty... Can you just tell me what to do? Balanced or not, you always have something smart to say. Hmm... I can tell you how I bounced out of the last dark pit I was in. Can you? Mm-hmm. Turned out that an old friend of mine is still alive. Made the best choice of all of us. Leave an NC before it gets you good. Oh, it got me anyway. But nothing's tying you to this place, V. No reason you can't leave too. It's a faces in the crowd thing. Might be our one privilege. A face in the crowd. So, somewhere to start anew? Gonna go looking? So many places I've yet to see. Maybe leaving is the best option. Might actually find the new me. Somewhere out there. If you land in a certain ancient forest in Poland, I'll help you look. My ride will be here soon. Lock me to it. again, I guess. Hope so. Oh, V. Do you still have that pendant I gave you? Huh. I must have misplaced it. Don't go looking for it. Doesn't matter anymore. you back in town. I cannot deny I am pretty fucking impressed. Used to be quite a lot of talk about your exploits at the afterlife. Even had a few folks gunning for you to have your own concoction on the menu. Maybe we leave them secure in their convictions. Maybe that's better. Don't get me wrong. Doors always open. You'll always be welcome at my club. But your legend? Well could wilt a bit more with each visit. Give it a think. 
Not as if we'd ever forget you, you know? I know you are in Night City and in good health. No more biochip in your head. Congratulations, V. Much time has passed. I did not know what to tell you. I needed the words of old samurai. He expressed my thoughts. Good, strong medicine is bitter to the mouth. When you disappeared, I and Hanako-sama confronted Yorinobu. His allies. We tried to capture Arasaka Tawa. We could not. They were strong. Hanako-sama is dead. I am called her murderer. I have been hiding for two years. My life is now the trash heap where I found you. I wish for you to know this. You are very strong medicine, he. A.V., I wouldn't mind knowing how you manage it. Langley awaits if you need a place to land. Don't look at it as a consolation or compensation. You'll be doing me a favor, not the other way around. Truthfully, I let you down. I let so me down too. But you, I can still help. Maybe I'll stop feeling so damn... Ah, just drop me a line, will you? Avi, it didn't quite work out in our last talk, huh? What do you say to giving it another try? We'll drink some beers, watch a legacy fight. Downtime to look back upon fondly in our new lives. They're looking to redo the clinic. Sending me off to Frisco of all places. <sighs> a new beginning for everybody, I guess. Though I have to say some proper closure could make it all easier to bear. It would, for me at least. You think you'd be up for that? <laughs>